slide up and that's it. Good morning. Happy Tuesday to you all. Welcome to this live. I know that I forgot to put the caption right, but I will fix that here shortly. Let me just pin this coffee link first and let me put the caption so that they know what we are talking about. So you guys know a little bit about what the caption means at least. Let me get to it. Let me put the caption here today. This is a very important one. When I say important one, important reason why I want to put the caption. Copy. Jesus, that person got the vehicle loud. Oh my God. Hey, one moment, my people. Let me fix the caption because I mixed putting it on this one. So let me put it on the other phone. Welcome everyone as you're joining in. Don't forget. You know what to do. Mm -hmm. Tap that dial. Tap that dial. The caption is, if you are truly a KO lover, then you should understand why. Let me put that in there. Let me refresh it. Make sure that the caption is big and bold and bright as well. If you are truly a KO lover, then you should understand why dot, 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 dot. That's what we're on today. Dot, 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 dot. And I'll elaborate more on that in just a few seconds here. So another minute or two. So don't forget to put your love and likes. My people, how are you all doing today? Keep the love and likes going. Thank you so much for sharing. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate you all. Thank you for the shares. Thank you for the like, the love, the cry face, the angry face. Whatever you put on there, it is okay. Just do something. <laughs> it all counts. It all adds up. It all comes out in the wash, like the people would say. So you know what to do, my people. Let's wait until we get some others over here. I'm sure once they see the caption, they will run and come, crawl on their four knees. <laughs> <laughs> they four knees, I said. Yeah, some of them got four knees indeed. But some might crawl on their fours to get over here. Let them come, let them come, let them come, let them come. Let them come, let me keep it real. Hey, hey I see you all. My people, I'm not going to call all your names, but you know, 
welcome to the life my people we're not looking good at all already if you didn't like the video go back like the video before you enter the live always like the video please and thank you thank you a bag a bag a bag a bag mr raphael king raphael in the house how are you doing today sir welcome to the life my night was great sir thank you for asking appreciate you appreciate you all good morning i see you in there per nine i see you all i see you all like the video love the video anything you want to do put some pudding on it put some sauce on it put some breadcrumbs on it some flour put something over there so that's all we ask you to do god is good indeed in each other said good morning sippy sweet and everyone god is so good yes he is amen to that he woke us up this morning we are here we are alive and we are well and even if you're not well we are praying for you but you're still well because why you're breathing you're here and as long as you're breathing you are okay even if you're having a little pain you're still alive tina said good morning korean peaches and simply sweet peach i'm tina and eh, i'm tina and not evil i'm as kind as can be did does people even look up the world evil 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 do they even look it up to see what evil really means it's a question that i want to know do they really understand what evil means mm, i don't think some of them do <laughs> i don't think some of them do stephanie john ford i see you in there darling how are you feeling how are you feeling my dear how is the job going how is your new job going you can send me a message on WhatsApp if you would like to, darling, instead of typing it on the live video. You can do that. But I'm thinking about you, darling, still keeping you in pray. Yeah, so, hello, Tammy G. Hi, Sippy Sweet Peach. God is great. Yes, he is. Amen to that. And anybody that don't like to hear the word God, I don't know which planet or which world you living in. You better wake up. Evil. Mm -mm -mm. guys okay let me see here so let me first of all we're gonna read something that somebody sent to me right and it ties in with my caption and we're gonna say as always make it make sense right so let me scroll down here and let me check the likes first before i move forward i'm the driver you know what i mean i gotta before i can move the bus i gotta make sure the passengers are seated before the bus move off, you know what I mean? Because some might fall out the door. <laughs> and why they might fall out the door? Because they did not pay. They did not pay. They did not put their coins in the machine. They did not get their transfer tickets. They seated because they did not pay. So let me refresh here. So, okay. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> Forgive me. Is it be a journey me? Oh, Lord. God, come on. We got like, we got like about. 30, no, I lie. We got 44 people that did not deposit your coins in the machine. You're going to fall off the bus, you know. <laughs> like the video. Hello, hello. Put your coins in here. Your coins go here. Your bus fare go here. In order to get a transfer, you need to put your bus fare in the coin machine. <laughs> or the dollar machine. Fold it, reel it out, put it in. Come on now, put some more likes on here. So before we get started. And then we will move forward. Likes are very important, my people. It helps to keep this page going. It helps the video to get out there, the algorithm, all of these things. You know what I mean? Just like the bus needs gas, the video needs likes or love or cry faces. There we go. Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Everybody buckle up. Let's move. Let's go downtown. We ready now. We ready to go downtown. Awesome. Thank you all so very much. So let me read this comment, my people. And you should read the caption as well again, right? Because it ties in. And purposely today, because I'm feeling naughty on this Tuesday, purposely I'm going to share the screenshot without blocking up the per person's name. Just because I feel naughty today, you know what I mean? I don't eat breakfast, so you know how I get when that happens. Here we go. I'm going to put the person's name right up here. So, Matthew Jakuhu J A. Matthew, J-A-C-E-H-O-U. Not sure if you're a man or a woman, okay? But let me take a deep breath before I read this comment here. So, because I know I'd be seeing you coming and peeping, you know what I mean? And nothing wrong with coming and peeping. 
because, you know, it's okay, we get it. But this is what Matthew Jacobi, Jacou, I, I can't pronounce that, okay? Forgive me, I'm Bajan. My accent ain't all that English, English. This person wrote this under Jeba Najiba post, all right? And I said to myself, really? Okay, let me see who's really evil over here. So, because the last time I checked, that woman is just living in a man house. That is the worst enemy, the devil that killed, was sleeping next to. Let me read this, sir. So, huh, apparently, this Najiba made a post, okay? This one going and write, agree, whatever the post was. I think I know what it was, but we don't need to read that post. Agree. Some of them use your name as content every nine o'clock their times. Okay. You, you could have put my name there, okay? Because you know I'm the one out here at the nine o'clock hour, right? But anyhow, every nine o'clock their times. And who's using her name for content anyways? Maybe you don't really understand what we were talking about. That's why I said, if you are really a core lover, then you should understand why. Why? But let me get to this part. Please, my dear sister... Do not go on any platform to talk anymore. I'm a K.O. lover, but some of her supporters are evil. Mm. Okay. So her allowing an ex-devil enemy of K.O. to use her to go and serve K.O. papers and to do all of this and allow her children to suffer in a mess and all these different things. You don't call that evil too? But anyhow... Let me ask you a question, because this I'm curious, and I hope that somebody on this live video might ping you and tell you that I call your name, right? Because I'm that bold, okay? My question to you is, how people telling this girl the right thing to do, trying to give her direction, trying to tell her the right thing to do, report for the children's sake, put the children first. If you see something in that house that might be detrimental to these kids, whether it's detrimental to their health, their mental health, their well-being, whatever, go and report it. Please report it. You can vent about what happened in the house with you and him and what he did. Yes, what he did was wrong by putting you out and the whole other nine yards that happened. Yes, we understand as women. But we also heard you say, Jebba, that the kids were going to be messed up or whatever word you use or that they were already messed up. So our concerns started focusing on the kids. Well, what, what, what are you doing about the kids? Did you report? Did you report the CPS? What's going on? What's happening with the children? That's our panic as mothers and as women. So again, how are we using this girl for content? Us coming out here and telling her, don't put your name on you by your. Do not say that you are Cora's nanny. Take Cora name down off of that. Take it away. Because no, no, no. You did not work for Cora. You did not provide any babysitting services for her. How is that evil? How is that using her name for content? Priscilla Gardens, greetings. Thank you so much for 200 stars. Appreciate you. Love you, darling. How is that using Jebba's name for content again? Make it make sense. And how are we evil just because we are telling her the truth? Go and report whatever you see at the house. As a matter of fact, you should be mad with her too if she didn't report what she saw going on over there with them children. So are we bashing her? Are we using her for content? No. We are telling her the truth. I sat here yesterday morning and I told her, don't worry about the gap in your resume. This is what you can do. This is what you can do. Just move on and go and live your life and do something different because this man don't care. This man ain't got no shame. I was not using her for content again. In my eyes, that's trying to educate her. And not only educate her on wisdom, because we are older, and we are trying to tell her, when you're dealing with a person that ain't got no damn shame, you could come out here and you could say that you vagadoodle him 10 times. He's still in care. He's still coming back like, Mr. Innocent, yes, you know, positivity. Let me work on this body's forehead and, and uh, the frontal and all of these things. So again, when you go around social media, typing all kind of things, make sure that what you're typing, that it makes sense. You are ready to embrace her. You are ready to say, don't worry. They're talking about you every nine o'clock the hour. Where? When? What we talked about is what she brought to the internet. 
what we were giving our opinion and reaction on again is what she brought to the internet. We didn't go and knock on her door, just like anybody else can blog about it. Anybody else can blog about it. Our concern was, hello, did you go report? Did you report to CPS? What happened with those kids? Did you? Like you saw things. Apparently the living conditions are not good for these children. Did you report? Did you send these things to CPS? That's all we were concerned about. Yes, we felt bad, sorry about what happened to her over there again, because we're not heartless and we're not evil. We are not evil, okay? So you to go right down under her page, knowing again, you don't know what else that woman was entangled with over there under that man house. We only heard that she, he gave her a piece of paper, go and hand this to my ex, okay? Serve my ex. Let me use you as the same black person to serve my ex who's also black. Go do it. That's what we heard. But do we know what else happened? Do we know what else happened? Do we know if she heard more? If there was more? Do we know if the London A-T-T-A-C-K? Do we know anything else? We don't know. We don't know nothing else. His mother came to his house. She was right there. He was calling Kia all kind of derogatory names right in front of her with his mama there. Do we know what else was said? Because as a woman, and I was hearing that, I would know that this man is no good. He is no good. He's calling his ex-wife a W. All these kind of things in front of children. What I have just said, no, I would have been like, mm -mm, something is wrong with this damn picture. Something wrong with this picture. That woman gone on with her life since two in half years plus now why is he talking about her like that why is he i mean hello but you know manipulation we understand but ain't nobody using jabba for no content miss matthew j so don't get it twisted okay so if you think that you're a kill lover you should understand you should understand what we're talking about when we tell her she and kill can never be friends don't wait for Cora to give you no reference like say what why would Kyo need to give you a reference for when you did not work for her? Why can't you understand them things? I don't get that part. So if you're truly a lover, why do you understand what we're trying to tell her? Take Kyo name off your damn page. Talking crap about a nanny for Kyo. No, 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 no. Oh, she, she, maybe she could be the kid's aunt. When? Where? How? Jesus. You can't understand that, Matthew. But you're a lover, right? And other people are evil. Course, so some course supporters are evil, but you are the lover. But you still cannot understand, or you can you still cannot digest what we are talking about, where we are going with this, and all concern is the kids. Do you really think that after her going and serving Cora Papers and her probably entangled with more stuff over that side house, you really think that Kill want her to be an aunt to her children? Hello? Did you not already go ask already? Make it make sense, right? So truly, again, when you go around typing things on the internet, make sure that you stand correct and make sure you come correct. Because you, Dessa, you got mad because I told you in 2023, don't write a certain pe person's name here on my platform or I will block you. So now people are evil, right? Hello, you did not birth people in this world. Everybody got their own minds, their own opinions to everything in life. People do not work by your clock. Tick, 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 tick. Everybody got a mind of their own and a thinking of their own. That's why God made all of us different. So if I tell you don't write a certain person's name on my platform, I was going to block you. You got mad and started. Oh, and I'm going back to that platform. Well, so what? So where you coming for? Hello? Because I've seen you many times. Your name sure. Facebook shows me you. Where you coming for? But to go and write something like that so petty, uh, to go and write something like that about people using Jebba's name for content every 9 o'clock of the hour of their time. Hello. Make it make sense, right? You want to be Jebba's best friend? Nobody gives a rat's booty. Go ahead and do that. But in turn, you want to say you're a KO lover. You're the lover and other people are evil. But you're the lover that cannot see what she's doing. Using KO's name for what? For what? Did she provide services to KO? Nanny services, any type of services? No, she did not. Did she do right by them children? No, she did not. Because, hello, I don't care how your situation is. You got family out there. 
you got friends and you be sure that you got family because you already gone back to them in New York. From the beginning, when you saw certain things happening to those children or around those children that was not right, you should have reported it. You should have reported it. I am sorry. I was a babysitter many years of my life when I first came to this country. And hello, when you see it and it's not right, it is wrong, you should report it. Period. What's wrong with that? Is that using Jehovah's name again for content? No, no. That's telling her the truth. Telling her, look, you know what? You said what you said. We're happy that you exposed this man and the filth and all this stuff that was going on around his house. But the question is, though, did you report it? What did you do? You know, nobody hating on her and nobody using her name for content either. We're just asking her honest, wise, important questions is what we're asking her. So don't get it twisted, Mr. or Mrs. Matthew, whoever you are. Again, don't get it twisted, okay? Because you are. And how can you be a lover? And you overlooking all these things, right? You're a lover of kale. I'm sure you're going to say that you love the kids as well, right? You love the kids also. Why are you not concerned about these things? Why weren't you concerned about these things? Did she report on these things she saw to the CPS? Why is she out here using Kiel's name? She started on Instagram tagging Kiel's name. Now she comes to Facebook now putting it at the top by her about bio. Them things they concern you? When she says she wants to be a nanny, she don't mind being a nanny to the kids. Maybe her and Cora could be friends. When? In which life? Seriously. But anyhow, let me read some y'all comments, okay? Let me read some of y'all comments today. Hmm. I got here all in my face, all in my mouth. Uh, thank you, Norma F. Norma F. Said, I pay my dues. <laughs> I pay my bus pay on this ride, so let's go. Ay, 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 ay. Anyhow, let me read some comments because I saw a lot of stuff going up in the comment section. Let me see if I can. Okay, all right, moving on down. Let's see if we can retrieve some of these things here. So, normally, I don't come out. And ready to waste my time to address some people normally. But after I see this 9 o'clock hour day time, I know that you're trying to, to talk about the Simply Sweet Peach. You could have typed that because either way, I would have still come and said something. Period. Uh, let me block that person there. <laughs> Tammy G said, I did put my bus fare in. Thank you for putting in your bus fare. Appreciate you. Oh, God. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm sorry, guys. Many comments were going up. I'm just trying to retrieve. And... Okay, so... Michelle stand up and say, Is that really a kill supporter? <sighs> That's what the person said, right? That's why I said, I don't know if it's a man, woman, named Matthew J. I don't know. I don't know. That's the thing I don't know, but the person has been around for some time because I always see them typing somewhere. The person used to come on this platform as well until I personally say, do not type. One day I said, don't type that person's name on my page. There was one particular person's name. That I said, don't type that person's name on my page. Otherwise, I'm going to block you. And that person got mad, gone on this other blogger's page and ready. Oh, I'm not going back to her page just because I typed such and such a name. She said this. This is my platform. I can say whatever I want. Whatever the hell I want. As long as it's within the guidelines and the community guidelines of Facebook. I didn't go and see the person's comment. But people were sending these things to me. So that name always stuck here since 2023. And I never forgot. So when I saw that one, Dessa, and they're talking about the 9 o'clock hour. Well, who's built here at 9 o'clock? Their time? Simply Sweet Peach, right? So make it make sense. And again, go back and reevaluate yourself and your thinking. Because if you were really a truly a core supporter, you would ask the question as well. Why didn't she report these things to CPS? Oh my God, look at the conditions the children were living in. Only God knows what else happening around these children. Or these strangers that are coming in that house that are bathing these children. Strangers. What else are they doing around the children? Are they smoking W-E-E-D around them children? All these things. Why didn't you go and ask her? Why didn't she report to CPS? And even if she now did it because of all the talk that's going around she did it late but still yet we gonna still ask why didn't you do it back then 
We get what happened to you. We get how we put you out after how you've been so good and you did this and you did that. We get that. And we are sorry to hear that that happened to you, but still yet remember that they were children that were right there in that house. If anything had happened to them children while you were right there in that house and anybody came, they would say, but you saw this in this house. Why did you report this? Well, are you supposed to be a babysitter? Why you, what do you need to report? These are things that you think about. So being a Korea lover, you should also be concerned about her children as well and their, their well-being and what's happening to them and how they're living. You should be concerned about that as well and not telling somebody, oh, those people are, are evil. Just uh, they, they, they're using you for content, please. What the girl got for me to use her for content? Man, get out of here. Anyhow, let me move on down. Moving on down. The bus is moving on down. Shalitra Hampton said, that is not a chaos supporter. Well, the person professed to they proclaim themselves to be that. Okay. I read it right here. So in the screenshot. Okay. They're a chaos lover. But don't worry, Jebba, my sister. Just ignore them people and this and that. You know, they're evil. Like, say, well, come on now. Come on. Please. Anyhow, um, Maria S. said, that person is not a kill supporter, period. <sighs> I was even shocked when I heard the news first came out that she's the one that went over there sir, and get caught that piece of paper. I was like, what? She actually let that jackass, she actually let that man use her like that to go and, to go and serve kill paper. I would have been like, hell no, I'm not getting in there. No, you have to hire somebody to do that. You think that I would have let him use me? Because I think that maybe I might be the next MVP of he house. He could not use me like that. I don't care what he did. Especially he wasn't paying me. Come on now. Seriously. Make it make sense, okay? No. Mm -mm. <sighs> now my F said, CP, that person could never be a kill. A Korean saying all those things about who using their name for content. Could you imagine? Could you imagine? People talk about anything that comes around this internet. Does that mean that they're using the person's name for content? No. And were we using her name for content? No. We were just telling the girl what is the best thing, what she should have done, what she should do. And at this moment, since she's dealing with a person that ain't got no shame and don't care, girl, just move on with your life. Fill in the gap of your resume as you took time off, personal reasons, whatever, and just go on and live your life because he still ain't going to care. If you want to enlighten other women out there of not what trap to fall in, no problem with that. But outside of that, leave Kale name out of it. Leave the children name out of it. That's all we said. That's all we said. And we said that for a few days because we were hoping that it got true to her. Because she came here before and listened to our video. Anyhow, Hazel Brooks is saying, if you see something, say something, report to the right authorities, period, dot, period. And the fact that young children, young children, toddlers that age, and you ain't said nothing, I know. Mm, mm, mm. Anyhow, Michelle Sanders, I was hoping she'd come out with information about UK, A-T-T-A-C-K. I agree as well, uh, because again, she was also in that house around that time when that happened. And you know the person that we talking about, meaning the ex, you know how he's run off with a chicken without the head. You know how he acted around that time. He must have said something in the house. Because right after that thing happened in the UK with Kyo, he gone and post something on social media. Then he coming out, he going to tell his story. And then he ramping. He would have had to be ramping in that house too. I'm telling you. So, you know, only God himself knows what he said out of his mouth around the time of that UK thing. Only God knows. But again, if I was in her shoes and he said a lot of things that were worse or that he wished that they had, you know, copied her or whatever, at this moment, I probably wouldn't say nothing either because then I would be implementing myself in the situation. So that's what I'm saying. Only God up above knows what the man said around that time in her presence. Only God knows. But we're not going you know, rub too much on that ear. So that's what I'm saying. You're a Kyo lover, but all these things are not going through your mind. Like seriously, come on. And nobody, I hate her. Nobody. Cause they know I don't hate people. No, I don't go to that 
level in my life. But I had a lot of questions for her. Why do you do this? Why do you do that? Where the children were concerned again, not where nothing else was concerned, where the children were concerned is my part that I played in my mind. And if you heard anything that came out his mouth around that time of the UK thing, that could have caused a suspicion in your mind. Why didn't you report that part as well? Just saying. Um, so let me move on here. So who is this person? Stock market. Seriously? Let me get rid of this. Shut from all my comments early morning. One moment, my people. One moment. Eh -eh. How this thing going? Go on. Let me... Uh -uh. Can't even delete on that phone. Anyway, and come back to that one. Let me put an angry face on that so I can remember you. I put an angry face. Uh -uh. It wouldn't even let me put an angry face. Can y'all believe that? Jesus, Hazel. Hazel Brooks. That was somebody that responded to you, darling. That also put a link in there. Can you put an angry face on that so I can come back to that, please? It's not. I put an angry face and it's just bouncing off. <laughs> Michelle said, I could care less about what he did her and what she did to him. True, yeah. We don't worry about that part of the vagudugu dagudin. We don't worry about that part neither. My concern was about the children, honestly. And yes, her as a woman of what happened over there. I mean, what he did, put her out there, sleep outside, whatever. Yeah, that was not right, truly. But Petty said, yes, they are... A lot more of KO supporters saying that you guys use her for information. My question is, did anyone force her to say what she said about Chucky? No. Did anyone knew what she was coming out with? No. Please, people, stop asking mischievous, mischievous questions around each other. Exactly. Please, we could come here. We ain't got to mention nothing about that, Gia. But once we think about things that surrounded him and the children, it will come up. It will come up. Why? Because she brought it to the internet. Nobody else did. She brought it to the internet because she wanted to share with people about what happened over there. Nothing wrong with that. She shared her own feelings. But when she started going to the place of using Kale's name, and then when I saw the part about Nanny for, uh, to quote Kale's, because I was like, what? Is it girl for real? No, 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 no. When I heard the part about being an auntie, I was like, no, 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 no. She going too far now. No, it will never get to that level. Uh -uh. Think differently, darling. Just move on with your life. Do your thing. Again, if you want to tell your story, that's your choice. But mm -mm. all them other things, all them other theories that you got in your head, and no, ain't going to go to that level, darling. I'm sorry. Uh, Margaret F. says she is just thinking about herself. She is not thinking about those cases, so it's Chucky. They're using the case to get what they want. Yeah. Um, so, Peter said, exactly, save the case, Jeva. Yeah, that's what we were saying for weeks now, right? That mean, are we using her name for content? No. We were saying, if you know anything... That could harm them children, be detrimental to their health, their mental health, whatever. Anything that you know that CPS would cause, that would cause a red flag for CPS, report it. That's all we've been saying, report it, report it. We've been saying that now for the past, well, two weeks or so. We have not been talking about this girl, who she related to, or was she this? No, we have not. That's talking about people, using people for content. We wait no further. We talk about what she brought out about Chucky and we left it there. So make it make sense at this point, truly. And trust me, when you think that you when you type all over social media on the Tom, Dick, Harry, Barry, Sophia, Melissa, when you think you're going to type on their page and people don't see your comments, people see you. People see your comments and they share it. They share it with a friend and a friend share it with another friend and a friend share it with a blogger and that's how it goes around these streets, all right? I'm just telling you right now. So you can't escape. It's just that some people choose not to come out and even say anything. Or even talk about what you write. Because they just laugh at it. But this one I didn't want to laugh at. Because the first thing that came to me was. Wow. Coral lover. That don't think about. That's not thinking about kill kids. Like seriously. 
That's all we've been talking about. Did this girl report this thing to CPS? Why didn't she report? Why did she keep talking? Why did she keep posting? Why did she report to CPS? That's all we've been saying. So, I don't know what to say to you. But anyhow, moving along. Moving on down. Peter, thank you for the star, darling, if I did not say that. And Vanny Griffin says, Simply Sweet Peach, who did that? I missed that part. Somebody by the name of Matthew Jaboa or somebody like that. I'm sure you've seen that person typing around the way. J-A-B-O-U-C something. That's a person, a person that said that they're the core lover, but still yet, nothing matters. Let me just embrace you, Jabba. Let me hug you. You don't got to worry about nothing. Just ignore them them ones over there at the nine o'clock hour because some of course supporters are evil. But let me just embrace you because after all, you live at JD for eight months and you saw them children living in all that filth. The children ain't even eating good, but it was okay with you. But let me just love you. Love her. Nobody is saying you should love her and give her money and help her out go ahead you should love people no matter what but when you see something that's not right question it ask questions wonder why why did you do this i said it before if she had ever came on my page to talk about the situation my questions would have been about the kids well, tell me, did you report this thing to CPS? Look at how that house was. How these children living? How these children eating? The things that are happening around these kids, did you report it? That would be my number one question. My number one first question would have been about the kids. Did you report it? Would have been my question. Then the second one would have been about the London ATTACK. -A -T -T -A Period. I'm just saying. Yes, I would have gotten to the part about him and her and whatever, but those would be my two most important questions there. So, God, the fact, again, that he used her to deliver and serve K.O. papers, what else did he say in your presence? Because if he felt that comfortable and that confident to use somebody that he met on Tinder to go and serve his ex, what else did he say? What else did he tell you? Especially knowing that you were there when this attack happened in the UK. Um, so I'm getting to your comments, guys. Just bear with me, okay? Sh uh, Caribbean Women Live Vacation said, I didn't ask her the same question as well. If she reports it to CPS or, I mean, cops or CPS, because that is our concern about the case. We understand that she went through some situation, but she can speak for herself. Facts. But the kids cannot. So this is really our concern. But Keo has nothing to do with whatever happened on the other side. Exactly. The thing should matter about Keo, two beautiful daughters. Exactly right, Dessa. Her beautiful daughters and her. Because mm -hmm. something also happened to her, to Keo as well, right? And nobody knows yet. Who did it? Who was part of it? But around that time, we could point fingers at a couple of people, you know what I mean? Because of all the nonsense that was going on back then. All the H-A-T-E that was being spilled out here back then. You get me? So, uh, let me see if we can connect my sister here. So, my sister who is not evil, very loving person, woman, kind-hearted. They're not evil to uh, know me rephrase that because you know they got some haters and trolls on here at this present moment. Like and love this video, my people. There's no H A T E in the people that we know here that are truly lovers and supporters. There is no E V I L either. Uh hello, your time. Good afternoon there. How are you doing? Uh, what's going on? I can hear two phones. Something's going on. I sound like an echo in on your end. Request again, you, darling. Come out and come back. I can hear you talking. Somebody's probably recording the video. There's no one in my house. No, not on you, darling. Somebody that's here is probably. Okay, let me just come out and come back. They can record it. It's, it's okay with me because, you know, I'm just going to speak truth regardless. So it doesn't matter. I think by now everybody should realize that it doesn't matter what they say or what they do to me. No, I'm not that kind of person. <clears throat> All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. 
connection fail. All right, let's try again. Keep the love and lights going, my people, for the true people that are here for the right reason. Always being for the truth. Okay, so you decline. The truth and standing against injustice. And injustice was also done at his house many times, okay? Many times. Let's try here. His mother is evil. He is evil. Anybody that stood around them, listening to their evil, wicked plots and plans. Hmm. Hmm. It's only now that things went sour that we heard about all of this. If things did not go sour or south, guess what? We would have never heard about it. We would have never seen all the filth. They will still be over there happy, still probably doing stuff together. And he's still cussing Cora every day and in front of her children. So, all right, let's see if this one works. So we only heard about it because things went sour. Uh, Tina, try again. Let's see how it's going with Edwina. Edwina, speak. speak. Good morning. Can you guys hear me? Good morning, sweet peach. Hi, darling. And yes, we can hear you. Good morning. The thing that I want to say is that, uh -huh. did you see what happened yesterday Tina. when Abner Nancy announced her new baby? I did not see what happened. How, I'm not on the internet like that. How backward, how hateful, hateful, despicable these people are. Very despicable. One moment. Is it good now, Tina? Or yes, it's good. I'm okay, in now. Okay, okay. All right. Very despicable, sweet peach. We, we were waiting for that, darling. We were waiting for that. We knew there we was. We have grown women talking about baby that was just born. Less than 24 hours. I did not hear them, but somebody texted me this morning. And me. somebody was saying that that one that i'm um, look like the poster child for in a de for in a depressed and 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 um vd talking about are we sure that this man did not sleep with that lady how just because your um, old husband might do that doesn't mean that you know every. Do you know what um, I'm sorry, Gacy? It's like you are in. You are in a world where where um, technology is in the tip of your fingers, and you you refuse to educate yourself. You refuse to educate yourself and you are talking you don't even know what surrogacy is well, illiterate is what they are how in no edwina can she even spell surrogacy <laughs> this no no this this is no more illiteracy right you know sweet peach I, we are in the world where the education is free. This, this is not a third world country. That in a, you, you can educate, you can go to school for free. Carol Charles, thank you so much for the 50. Edwina, I appreciate you, darling. You know, somebody sent me that, and I was like, at first, I first looked at the comments. The people, not everybody in those comments were even agreeing with that individual. I was I laughing. The comments. I never see nothing they wrote, but no, somebody sent me sent me the post mm -hmm. and the comments and everything. And you know, sweet peach, if it's not if it's a non-event, I don't send it mm -hmm. to you anyway. Mm -hmm. But then I was I I, I did my research actually mm -hmm. as soon as uh, Nancy came out yesterday. And I, and I asked somebody, I asked one of the sisters on mm. here about it. And they explained to me actually how it happens. Mm. And I said, I'm not the type of person who goes on Facebook mm. and makes a fool of myself saying something that I don't know. Mm. I might be 50, but I wasn't aware that all women mm. 
who are, you know, of age can actually breastfeed. So I asked my friend who is actually a child nurse and she explained it all. And I thought, wow, okay. Yeah. So it can happen. Yes, it can happen. And it's, 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 it's a normal thing. And then I said, okay, so if that can happen, there is absolutely nothing wrong. And actually, the person actually gave me a history of how Nigeria has been doing this for many, many years. I was shocked that Nigeria does that. That's the part I was like, wow. Do you know, I, w I am so empowered now mm that I was even thinking of my niece, who I think I spoke about my niece before. Mm -hmm. And I even phoned my niece and spoke to my niece for two hours. And I was saying, you guys could look at this. You could go to Nigeria mm -hmm. and you could do this, yeah. just like what this, you know, just like what exactly. has happened. And you can still breastfeed your baby mm -hmm. and you will be the mother of the baby. And I heard all the science and everything. Yeah. And, I was, and, my, and my niece was like, oh, mom, that is great. That is so mm -hmm. good. And I was so yeah. proud that there is actually a country in Africa that is pioneering exactly. this. And you don't have to go to, to America or to the UK, which is expensive, mm -hmm. which, would cost, which would cost thousands and thousands of pounds or yeah. dollars. Yeah. And you can just go, you can just go to a country which which is like two hours away, and you will have exactly. your baby. Exactly. It's, look, and my niece was like, "Wow, can you please send me? Can you please send me Nancy's details so that I'm I can sure, get you, into it?" You know, and I am so I'm sure Nancy, happy. She's probably, gonna do a, she's probably gonna do a video on it, like talking about. Yeah, she said. She, yeah, she just said today. She just said she's gonna yeah. do it. But then you know, I'm not the person that is involved so my niece wants to phone the agency right, right. and start the ball rolling for her yeah, be because she can't carry her own baby full term because of the fibroids oh, okay. but this is a good the thing that nancy has brought to light sure. to me is something that my niece can be doing exactly. and we could i could be a grandmother in nine months exactly. time exactly. So I quickly sent her all the details, all Nancy's details and said, just give her time because she's got a little yeah. baby, but then you can contact her through email. Amazing. And I will also, I'll also ask mm -hmm. Nancy to explain the process to you and I'll link you with Nancy so that, and I was so happy. Yeah. Yeah, amazing. And I said, I am not coming on social media to make a fool of myself because I'm not aware of it. Then my friend, who's a child nurse said no tina you know if you have a sister mm -hmm. or your mom and you and you and um maybe you can't breastfeed for health reasons yeah. or whatever your sister or your mom can actually breastfeed your child yeah. every woman yeah, I've seen people doing that who menstruate yeah. can actually have milk in their breast mm -hmm. and i didn't know i didn't know this yes because they were actually, sorry, Edwina, I know you were talking about that individual, but they, they were discussing this thing that why is she breastfeeding? Uh, she adopted the child. And adopted. I'm like, it okay. It is not adoption. It is her ex and the husband <laughs> to but You know what, Edwina? It's even if it's time. adoption. Wow. Even if it's adoption. For me, even if it's adoption, even if wow. I adopted a child now, that child is going to be loved. Why would I any parent? They call me why would any parent comment on another parent's choices? Do you know that you're putting curses on your no, you children? Know and you've got no, okay. no, you know they're really illiterate. They call you have boy, boy children. <laughs> you have boy children. Are you are, are you sure that those boys oh, can actually oh, birth children? Oh are you sure? What if God makes those sons of yours not able to have children? What are you going to do? They know your illiteracy. Wow. They know your illiteracy and their hate is, is I'm too great. It's very great that in a day don't care. Me and you, we care because we have love in us. 
these people I tell you when you don't have mm -hmm. love in you when um, you were dry like the Sahara Desert mm -hmm. you, you do not care period wow because if you care okay the Bible says that we should rejoice when somebody is rejoicing mm -hmm. right yeah it is not my place to tell you how you should rejoice if you are happy i will be happy with you mm -hmm. that one the amino lizard went on facebook for three hours with 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 1.2k view when she was supposed to be sleeping what? she said she she and had a job Talk, talking about, about the baby oh my god are you how sorry? foolish can you be what she sat on that internet in on Beyonce's internet for three hours for just 1.2k and the hell? people that actually watch this woman wow. there is something wrong with them good lord jesus because the... how <laughs> how can you watch somebody talk about a newborn baby i'm telling you know what there are so I, I i also noticed that people that are informed mm -hmm. and are from nigeria know that there are many other people in nigeria actresses that, that have done the yeah. same thing in the adult did it wow. in the adult did it like it is not everybody can i mean carry shoes wow, this, wow. these people are sick no it's like their their hatred yes. has consumed them yes, so much that they have gone to the lowest of the lowest of the lowest mm -hmm. of the bottomless mm -hmm. wow 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 i knew they were coming though because you know they're so calculated that you already knew, i already knew they were coming let me give you another shocker. Do you know what the, the lizard said? She actually called the baby a lizard. And I am a lizard. Yes! So, yeah. These women, I am shocked. I am glad I am from Southern Africa. We do not do beef like that. We do not do, we do not hate like that. That girl yes. got that much P-O-I-S-O-N in her? Jesus. I am telling wow. you that I am so glad I'm from Southern Africa and we do not do that. We don't beef like that. You can be angry with somebody, but you do not go that far. You got him from the islands. Jesus. Calling a child, mm -hmm. a little child yes. from God. For the stars for this. Are you a lizard. Yo, that one day coming, you know. Her day is coming down, I tell you. I have a you can question, get right? Wow. I I have a question, right? Damn. She said she doesn't like oh. in a KO because Keho called her a thief, which I'm um, she is a thief, right? What mm -hmm. is her mm -hmm. beef with Nancy? What did oh. Nancy do to her? But you realize that it trickled down from KO to the whole family for her? She just got this vendetta. She's like a Jezebel, like just a wicked witch. From somewhere because if I said, okay, if mm -hmm. I said that oh uh, I don't like um you know um I'm no sister Tina because of A B C D. Mm -hmm. What is Sister Tina's family, that the is. rest of the family right. did to me for me to have so much hatred, mm -hmm. venom for wow. the rest of her family? So sad. Mm -mm -mm. Edwina, like I said. I asked people who are involved in this and they explained the process and I was proud. Mm -hmm. I was so happy to tell my niece who is going through uh, some issues that this is, you know what, this is a game changer for you guys. Thank and my niece thank was like, wow, mom, I am onto it. Thank God. I am getting thank God that the, You know, the baby came and prayed over the baby. Thank God. Yes, that, he did. Thank God that they have a praying father. Thank God for that. Can you understand this? These people <laughs> act like they are Ill illiterate sweet wow. peach. And then when I spoke to, to my sister, who's actually from that side, she says, you know what? 
Nigeria has been doing it for so long, Tina. Yeah. And it's not a, it's not a new thing to do surrogacy. No. And I'm like, I didn't know. In my country, there's only one clinic and it costs thousands and thousands. Mm. And it's not even safe. But if you're telling me, I have seen a beautiful baby, Talia, Tobe Tuku, and she is beautiful. And you're telling me her DNA is her mom and her dad, and her mom can right. breastfeed because for five months, five months, she's been on medication mm. that makes her lactate mm. and have milk. So what is the point? Which means God has given somebody wisdom to help women that are not able to carry their babies full stop have been doing it for years many celebrities all over the world have done that uh, uh, many michael jackson yeah. did it yes. paris hilton did it um what's that one the the the, the, the one with nyash what's her name the one Maybe with your did it Nyash. No, no, no. The one who's now a lawyer. What's the, what's that music? That public figure in America. The woman, yeah. Hmm. No, I'm not sure who you. Mean. With big, big Nash, with big Nash, Kim Kardashians, the Kardashians. Hmm. So many people have done this. Even Naomi Campbell. Naomi Campbell is fifty something years old. Do you think? Do you think she carried the baby in her womb? Hmm. But she has a baby. It's the industry sister, are... Tina. Oh my God. These people are in a, yeah, in a place that they, I mean, they refuse to basically educate themselves. And the one, the one that called herself a, I mean, an engineer and saying that she worked for the airport, which she doesn't work for no airport. In That's the why she got too much time on her hands. She probably... As for me, guys, in nine months or so, in ten months, I will be a new grandmother. Con and I'm going to well, come here on this platform and show off. <laughs> I'll be going to Nigeria and I will be showing off. You will see. Well, you will not they stop they me. Matter what they say and what they do. I'm sure that Chenna and Nancy and the whole family is just blissfully happy and they're going to enjoy their new baby. And it's theirs. Congratulations uh -huh. in advance. I didn't know that this thing is available in a country that I can afford to send my daughter. And I am so happy, world. sweet peach. Yeah. The baby is. Good. They don't yeah. even need visas like how they would be it, for me to bring them to to England or to America. It would cost more. Mm -hmm. To Nigeria, it's just like going across, you know, on a three-hour flight, and you're in Nigeria. Okay. Um, this. Look, some people these people are very foolish so we should mm -hmm. not give them a, like for you to sit there and be talking about a child that is newly True. born oh jj exactly let me say let me read what jj said as well which is a great point jj said that thing is not for the poor so let them talk exactly because some of them wouldn't even be able to afford that they wouldn't even probably be able to come if they have the money to do it they never won't be able to come up with the common sense to do it all together anyways <laughs> lord have mercy but honestly sweet peach for people to have so much wow. hatred in their hearts do you know i don't hate nobody in my mm -hmm. life that's why i even joked and put that comment when i said good morning korean mm -hmm. peaches i am not evil my name is tina i try and be kind because that individual no but that was that you know that was directed at that individual i was trying to say I know, look i know you don't you do not call people names like that it's not right it is not right i i'm sorry edwin i digress a little bit from what we're talking Continue. about i'm talking about the 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 caption that sweet peach put apparently we are we on this platform are evil so this is what i want to say yeah, to that person God still got us here, right? just because sweet peach reprimanded you on her platform you have to go to other platforms and talk if sweet peach said to me today tina i no longer want you to come to my platform i will kindly say okay sweet peach thank you and move 
I don't have to go to another platform and talk about Sweet Peach or what happened. Why are you even involving this platform on that platform? Mm-hmm. I don't did get I it. Something. Yes, you did. Oh, please, I, I'm well, apparently, you didn't really put me in, in my inbox. You didn't read really the caption, apparently. A Korean is calling us E V I L on this platform. And, and, and Rina, I'll, I'll read it for you because some people didn't get it either. So that way they get it now today. I even showed it because I don't care. When I say showed it, they might, they might, they might okay. sweet pitch. They might think Tina is going off on one. Read it, read no, it, no. read it. That's why I said when I first came, I said I'm even going to show it without even editing the person name either. Thank you so much for 200 stars. Uh, Sonia Pink, appreciate you, darling. Thank you all for the stars. So, Edwina, you might have seen this person around the way. Several times I see them coming here. Apparently, this platform is evil, but they're still finding their way here. One Matthew, J- J- Kau, something, J A C H O U. I can't pronounce it, okay? So, I'm not saying the person's a cow. I just can't pronounce that. Anyhow, this person went and wrote under Jebba's post. One of Jebba's posts. I don't know which one it is because this came to my inbox. Um, some of them use your name as content every nine o'clock their time, which is obvious, yes, right? We always over here around mm-hmm. the nine o'clock their time, right? Uh, please, my dear sister, do not go on any platform to talk anymore. I'm a Cora, so a Cora lover, but some of her supporters are evil. But this person is allegedly a KO lover, but can understand what we've been trying to tell this girl. Go report, go report anything you got to CPS. You're the truth. Sweet Peach, there is no way I would call another Cora supporter that name. Even if I did not like what somebody else has said, I just look at it and I just put myself in their shoes. I would never, never, God forbid, I would put my mouth and call another person who is supporting the same person as me in that category. Never even matter what they call or what they say truly but facts is facts right if you call yourself a supporter then you should be understanding to what we've been telling this girl that she should have done and then when sweet peach edwina sweet peach explained that she reprimanded the individual and told the individual not to write some name of in course, the comment in 20, section yes, in 2023 when this was something thing was going on that person wrote a specific person name here i said do not write that person name on my platform anymore if you write the person name on my platform i'm gonna block you next thing you know so the person is going to be sending me screenshots with this person right now oh they're not coming back to my platform because i said they write that person name i I, i'm going to block them why am i trying to protect this person wasn't about protecting nobody is that i didn't want the person's name to be written in my comment section and I made that clear to everybody, not just that one person. I said it out loud, but I directed at that person because they are the one who had wrote it at that time. So, so now this person, now Edwina, has gone on to Jiba's uh, post, which right. Jiba made, and called us all names. You know, I could disrespect, but I'm not because I'm not the owner of this platform. Yes. Because See you, that, Jiba, you. It's okay, meaning that person. It's okay. We know that we're not evil. Okay, how many platforms has been around this block in the last almost three years that have been talking about this and a lot of them not here anymore? But this one is, what I tell you? Guys, put some like and like on this video, please. We got 300 and, uh, 314 people on here and the likes are not matching. Please check if that person comes because I'm even blocking that no, person as well. I don't want to know about them. They're not going to come today because somebody... In fact, I'm even going to tell Cora about no. that person because I'm not happy. No, I mean, I understand, but no, 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 sweet peach. No, no, no. <laughs> I get you. No, 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 no. We're gonna if we're doing playground stuff, we'll do playground stuff. <laughs> I get you. I, we do playground I, stuff. We do playground I, stuff today. I don't care. <laughs> My thing is this, right? Yeah. It just shows that this person is just looking for trouble. Because, mm-hmm. like, for me, I don't see anything wrong. If, if if I am coming out with my story in the wrong way, and then 
and you know yeah the people that you know um you know love um you know ko mm -hmm. they are advising you no mm -hmm. don't do it this way do it that way <laughs> i should not imagine feel mm -hmm. any way of offended because they know more of what they are talking about because yeah. i'm just coming yes. that exactly. that is just me thinking on my own and if you are on somebody's platform mm -hmm. and you put a name on that platform and then the owner said to you please do not type name you have to respect the owner of the platform if Edwina, you don't respect, how many don't times come back. And then, how many times has sweet peach explained to us even me tina her little sister she has told me things and said no 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 tina don't do that don't say that do i then go on another platform and say hey no. sweet peach said this about me and guys huh? the thing about it is that i did not say to the person don't come back i said nobody should write that person name in my and my videos don't write that person name here that's why i said to everybody you know and I said, you write it, mm. don't write it again because I will block you. I don't you. see anything bad with it. No. In my opinion, <laughs> right? Then. I don't see anything bad with it, Sweet Peach. Mm -hmm. Because at the end of the day, you have the right to run your platform in the way that you want to run it. Because you were the one that opened it. You were the one that built your platform. You were mm -hmm. the one that built your brand. So basically, if um, that person is coming out here having some type of um, psychological, you know, ish ish, it has nothing, nothing to do with you. Mm -hmm. and, and if that person wants to go around and be talking crap, I would even entertain them. That's, that mm -hmm. is just me personally, because it's like I have the right to say I don't want this on my platform. Mm -hmm. They wanted the sweet pitch to come out and reprimand an adult. Yeah. Said, I remember that. No, honestly, I remember a too. Lot of you have been coming here from 2022. Way back when I know you. Know, I know the I know the story. You know me already, how I operate, things that I would say, don't say that here. But not to say don't come back. But if you get mad and choose not to come back, that's your choice. I mean, it's up to you. That's mm. your choice. Am I gonna sit down and cry over it? No, no, mm -mm, I will not. But Some I speak people my mind. are just that's looking me. for ways to basically make themselves. Better. You see, Gloria Jones is even saying, our Queen Gloria is saying, Sweet Peach warned me about that already. <laughs> so, <laughs> that day when I said it, many people were here when I said that that day. That was her, probably 2023, maybe March, somewhere around there. Many I know, I know, I know. but you didn't want. To a platform associated with all the noise that was happening at that time. And I did Full not want stop. The person name on here. Period. Being type on here because because that person was actually looking for yes, your trouble anyway. And if the if her name had been put on the platform, she would have dragged and us as well into her mess. The disrespect that came because of that thing where it happened on my video with mama and cc at the end of disrespect it, well, it was many things that i said don't take that person's name here you understand and that's all i said i will yes. yes that was it but anyhow you know life goes on but i wanted to make sure that i address this comment because i'm trying to say okay you are saying that you're a ko lover and some of ko supporters are evil so because we are telling miss jebba that you should go on to cps report anything that you see around these children that was not good for them and long amongst other things how does that make us evil Don't put do you know what we teach do you remember no. last week when cora was saying i see comments from people who say they are koreans this is a typical example of that this is a typical example of what Cora was saying last week in her life that she sees some comments by individuals who purport to be Cora lovers mm -hmm. but go on platforms and say things about her. Yeah. Cora is not stupid. Mm -hmm. Cora said, I have seen some of you people who say you love mm -hmm. me saying bad things about me on other platforms so obviously some people have shown cora these things mm -hmm. you see so 
for me personally, as yeah. Tina, I don't want to have nothing to do with this individual. As soon as I come off this life, I am blocking that person, and that's it. Yeah. I will block that person so that I don't see that person. Even though we are supporting Cora, I don't want to see her views. I don't want to see her nothing. I don't want to even be in her space. Otherwise, I'm going to go cray cray. Mm -hmm. but, you know, what I, I can go cray cray, and I don't want that. I just want to keep it peaceful, keep mm -hmm. it moving. So for me to keep it peaceful, I would rather not see that person and I'm happy. But you see what I do, right? And I'm People happy. Because yeah. otherwise, we pitch, each time I see them typing yeah. anywhere on any other Korean page, I'm going to get you angry. See what I did, right? Thanks, 2023, yeah. people sent me screenshots of what that person wrote on other korean spaces i could have blocked that person saying then but then i i didn't because i really didn't care you understand what i'm saying but the person <laughs> <laughs> edwina <laughs> says Tina, don't go cray cray <laughs> they're not coming back to my platform but they've been coming i've been seeing their names they just haven't been typing but i see them but it doesn't matter to me you know what i mean because i'm not petty <laughs> sabrina i can go really low 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 and this is the thing even Cora sees it herself that some of us are not pure at heart. They are not pure at heart. Mm -hmm. And I am spiritual as well, sweet peach. If you're not pure at heart, I will catch you out. Even if we're on the same side. This person is being blocked <laughs> after this. Dina said, uh -uh. calling me evil. Uh -uh. No, there's no. nothing wrong with people having their opinions um reactions to certain things that's life we live in a world that we can do that right somebody walking on the street with no clothes you could be oh my god look at this person they're walking on the street maybe they lost their mind or somebody probably put them up without their clothes that's you reacting you understand what i'm saying that's life we all mm. have that in us, yeah period but not to sit down and say that because a person have an opinion about something or reaction about something that they're evil how you arrive at that evil is uh -uh. evil is the ex Okay, was I'm sorry. That, 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 that <laughs> word cut deep for me. I need prayers. I need to fast and pray. I need mama to pray for me before I go cuckoo, cuckoo, gaga. Inhale, <laughs> inhale, and exhale. And inhale, and exhale. I would do. Truly. Yep. It was laughing. This social media. Anyway, let's talk about it but the part where i saw about making jebba their content at the nine o'clock hour i'm like what who is making jebba their content are you serious we didn't even know who was jebba till jebba brought this story about what <laughs> over there so even now we pitch do we even know who jebba is no, and me i still stand on my i will still stand on my no, facts i will still say what i said that day sweet peach mm. that for me things do not sit well at the moment i didn't i say that on here do do I, we know do we know if if, if, G, if G was even one of the people that helped even call to the uk thing when ko went over there we don't know none of these things that's my whole uh, point uh, but you ready and <laughs> so you want me not to have a view you want me to just say oh hallelujah you want me yeah. to sing kumbaya and say oh jemba jemba yeah, yeah. Yeah. good girl you didn't need to call no ah, not this girl not this, this girl. girl me i don't think kumbaya with people mm -hmm. i stand i can stand alone and as of today i will block you even if you're a korean i will block you so i don't see your nonsense Dina. otherwise me ima go Dina. cray cray Dina. on you Take a deep breath and block, block the person right now <laughs> block them right now because <laughs> I'm so somebody probably already alerted them that the name is being called over here. That, that's why I need to tell KO so that KO is the way. I left them open. I don't block people like that unless they really come and put angry faces or you know offend me in a different way. But otherwise, I leave it open because I'm. <laughs> anyway, guys, I'm not going to go cray cray. Don't worry. Happy <laughs> Tina. <laughs> <laughs> I can be a lioness. People from my country can tell you that my surname, my surname means lioness. And I can go into that lioness mode if you want. 
We can go there. I was listening to you, yeah. Don't turn into a lion, not a so we are, what? We are in too much rolling. <laughs> too much rolling. rolling. <laughs> Good morning, baby. How are you, darling? Morning. Hi, JJ. Good morning, morning. Dinner's just red dead. <laughs> <laughs> morning, Tina. Morning, Edina. Morning, Edina. Sister JJ, I'm gonna be a grandmother soon, thanks to Nancy showing us a beautiful way of doing it. Listen, Tina's niece is not even pregnant yet. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I know, right? Morning. I'm tapping into that already. Um, Edina and and Tina, listen. Yeah. Um, for me, I just want to say. Congratulations to Nancy yeah. yes. and uh, for the haters, um, knowledge is power, right? Mm -hmm. the, the only thing I didn't know, because this thing is not new to me, mm. um, I didn't know about the breastfeeding part because who, who, who I know that do it, we, they never um, show that part. So that part for me is new yeah. and uh, yeah i would like to know a little more on that part okay let, let me tell you what i found out what i found out is that when a surrogate is picked out for you you can take their their tablets remember how people were saying oh Na nancy you look pregnant oh nancy you look this mm. that was the that was the hormones that were oh. showing on her oh. because she's been having treatment alongside the pregnant woman oh so, um, yes, there's, there's medication so that she lactates, so that her breasts have uh, milk, produce okay. milk. That's a good, yes. good thing. That's a good thing. Yeah, it's a, it's a very good mm -hmm. thing, JJ, mm -hmm. because it gets, it, you know, breast mm -hmm. milk is, I know there are some people that can't breast breastfeed because of health right. reasons, but breast milk is very good for a right. baby. So even today when she did a, a voiceover, she said, can you see the breast pump in my room? I've been breast uh, pumping for the past five months. Nancy said it. Oh, okay. So you see, you see, sweet feet. Yes. Yeah, go ahead. Yes. You see it? So that it gets ready mm -hmm. for when Talia is born, mm -hmm. the milk will come out easily. Right. And you could see in the video she did at the hospital, the doctor was telling her, put, put her mm -hmm. on. So that she latches onto the breast. Right, right, right. You see? Yes, because the issue is not the breast, but the issue is in the is in the womb. So the breast is fine, the breast milk is fine. And mm. she's been having the tablets for the past five oh, months. Okay. But for us, so my sister who's on here told me yesterday Go ahead, that it that it's possible and it's what People have been doing it for years. Mm. Because even me, I wasn't aware that you could do that. I thought you just, uh, you know, use formula for the baby. Then mm. my sister said, no, Tina, technology has advanced right. so much that it can, even if like your husband, mm. your husband can be sucking the boobies and the milk will come out. And she would tell, you know, she was telling me in a way that I can understand it. So that by the time the baby is born, the milk is ready. Yeah. There's nothing even amazing. All this nonsense that they are saying, oh, adoption, oh, all this, that's the, all in their heads. Nancy is a big woman. She's a big woman. She's rich. The obedience are rich. Adoption, really? uh, uh, Tina. You know what some of them were saying? Oh, you're not going to have your baby in America like the other two. <laughs> Seriously? Please. You know these women are so petty, sweet peach. Yeah. If the baby was not <laughs> the thing that I'm saying, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just like how we don't know a certain thing and we can ask questions about it instead of being ignorant True. and open your platform yeah. and talk about something that you don't have no knowledge about mm -hmm. and, mm -hmm. and start to speculate. It's best some of these um bloggers or whatever they call themselves ask question and stop being mean you mm -hmm. understand exactly. because how does it profit you to come on your platform and talk mean about a, a, a newborn is, that you don't have, have a knowledge about the situation 
or the process, nothing. Yesterday in the comment section, I write um, asking a question about um, Nigerian money. Can um, how much is a thousand naira in US? Reason why I ask. I saw a picture of a house, and the person mm -hmm. says, "See what three million naira give me." And I was oh. like, huh? three million naira." Yeah. And I was like, "If three million naira give that person that big house, mm -hmm. how much is three million naira?" Right. So yesterday I was speaking to my daughter, and I said to her, first I said to her, um, because I was so excited, I said. Cora's sister um, have another baby by surrogate. And my daughter said, what? She rich. That was what she said, you know. <laughs> what? She rich because... It's 1.6 million. Yes, listen. Because it doesn't take a little person. I'm not saying anybody can do it. Anybody can do surrogacy. But you got to be... You got to have money. You understand? Sure. To ma yeah. maintain that, that thing. Wait, and then... You Tina one point six million for what for the surrogacy? No, one thousand one thousand US dollars is one point six million. Yes. Go ahead, so, so yeah. I said to her, so, I said to my daughter last night, I'm gonna ask on the platform this morning about the money. And she said, Mommy, Google it. So right. I then said to her, JJ, hmm? that's that's why I'm even saying I'm sending my relative there because for me to send pound which is stronger than the dollar right. can you see that i will pay less right so then i said to her ask google mm -hmm. what a thousand us can buy in in, in <laughs> <laughs> it's like i want to know the culture so bad you understand what i mean i want to know yeah. If yeah. somebody can say they buy the three million naira, give them this big beautiful house. Mm -hmm. Who is it? So then I said to her, "Look at me, I forgot to move go Nigeria, because <laughs> if <laughs> if the money is so strong over there, right. and what what you can buy." So she when she googled about um one thousand US in Nigeria, she said it can buy you a, a poultry farm. I said poultry farm. I said man. <laughs> but what I'm saying, knowledge is power. Yes. If you don't know something, yes, you ask about it, yes. or exactly. you Google or something. More than being ignorant yes. and complain yes. and start jump to conclusion, because when mm -hmm. you're gonna say maybe the husband slept with the woman, shut up, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> That's what they were saying, JJ. That's what I'm saying. Yes. You don't know. Do you know what Long Mouth said, JJ? She said, maybe even the other two are like that. And I'm like, these people are so illiterate. I fear, you know, sometimes I don't want to rub shoulders with people who are not educated. But, God help but me. You know, even ah. if the other two is like that, that means, sir, uh, Nancy is a big boss. Period. She is a big boss. <laughs> it doesn't take somebody like me in mid Africa save till me can't save no more. <laughs> right. Does people just <laughs> go in and take out and do their business but yes. what i'm saying i see evil candy bars from um the real housewife of atlanta mm -hmm. she did it with her last child and listen that little girl is the dead stamp of her mother mm -hmm. it is the splitting oh. image of her is mother it? everything <laughs> so if if the baby looks like the dad that's why they're saying is the father sleep with the, the lady, you know, because the little baby <laughs> look like the dad. They're so ignorant yeah, and stupid. Take up, take up um, Google or sit and ask somebody who is educated enough to explain to you guys what it is before you come on your platform and be in an ASS mm -hmm. in front of thousands of people who is watching you. You understand? JJ, I took 30 minutes of my time yesterday to ask one. We have so many sisters on this platform that have different um, qualifications. Mm -hmm. I know that there's one sister who is a, um, a child nurse 
in America. So I approached her yesterday and asked everything about this. That's why I said, after I finished that call in America, I phoned Africa and my niece was so excited. That's why I'm saying I'm going to be a new grandma yes. soon. You know what, too? <laughs> From now on, sweet peach, yeah. then you need to put a little respect on Nancy's name, the, the mm -hmm. Ume's name. Yeah. Put respect on their name because they're not no little... Um, listen, they cannot walk in their shoes. Period. They can exactly. cannot because they're... Listen, I look up to people who are up there because you don't want to be down here all the time. You understand mm -hmm. what I mean? True. Certain people inspire you. Those are the people. Sweet people Peach, let me you. drop off in case somebody okay. else wants to come on. Those are the people that you <laughs> Because you know to. me, I won't drop off because I'm angry today and I'm going to block that person. Love mm -hmm. you guys. You are great. Yeah. I'm gonna drop off. You are beautiful. You are wonderfully made. You come at nine o'clock for two years, <laughs> non-stop. That is called support. When people come, right? come before nine, but that's when that person show up. That's when. <laughs> All right, guys. Love I'm you. Drop off. I'll, I'll be in the comments. Have a good night. Thank you. Eddie. Sorry. All right. Uh, sweet okay. peach is best for someone want to be yeah. like or yeah. you know. In, get inspired by someone more than tearing them down. True. For three years, they have been tearing down Nancy, and I don't see what they're doing. Mm -hmm. They they don't have a little business on the side. True. You understand? Mm -hmm. They they can't. When you look at Nancy, mm -hmm. you you have to talk. You have to talk a different type of talk when you talk to Nancy. You can't just talk to Nancy any anyway. For those ladies who are a uh, uh, girl like said Nancy and them, they're on the same level. Yeah. You understand? I understand? You have to level up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, some people, because they, they cannot reach, because they might, they, they're so small-minded, small, small minded, they talk crap about the person who we are ahead of them. Right. Because of bad mind and jealousy. See. You can't be happy for somebody for, the, for one time in your life. Mm -hmm. Because because you're small minded. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. And hungry so, for content. Hungry for content. And, and some people the, the, the world is revolving, sweet peach, where so many different things are happening and you wonder how, why and when. You understand? Mm -hmm. And some people will never understand it because they don't take the time out to know. You understand? And some people you have some woman who cannot conceive. And there are different ways where you can and some people work towards it. Mm -hmm. Some people conceive two, three kids, and um, they can't do any more, but they want more kids. Exactly. And there are other ways and options where you can have other kids. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's happening in, 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 in Nigeria with a lot of people, but nobody show it. And now you have somebody in Nigeria showing their journey doing this and you have some negative fools who are shutting down this thing right and calling it something different because to show how small their mind is you understand mm -hmm. you have some woman now will say will reach out to nancy or when whenever nancy talk about whatever she's going to talk about people mm -hmm. will move towards it because a lot of people need to have kids can't have kids yeah did not maybe they they only see it in in the us or uk and maybe yeah, don't have the money but another sister is um sharing on with me on whatsapp that is called ivf um ivf where they take the husband's sperm and, and the, her, her egg yes it's called ivf yeah is what yes. the sister is telling me yes it's both and, of them child it's not it's not no one-sided thing it's both of them child and they, they, they put it together listen science is going a long way people it, if you just sit that, down and depend on one subject for two years i know hope mm, your mind mm -hmm. you, you're gonna be stuck you're gonna mm -hmm. be stuck it's like you have some people sweet peach who live into a community 
and they never go anywhere else. Mm -hmm. So they don't know what is going on in another community. True. I'm not saying another country, no, I'm saying another community. Right. They just talk there. So they don't know. Mm -hmm. But when you come on the platform before you talk rubbish, please. Some things. Get some knowledge about something before you talk and open your mouth. Yeah. Because your man is so narrow and small. You hear what they're gonna say? Maybe it's the man XYZ. Shut up. Imagine. Shut up. Take Google and and and, and Google surrogacy before you talk because she did call the word. Right. She did not say adoption. She did <clears throat> not say adoption because people can adopt also. Mm -hmm. But they go the other way, where the child is theirs. And the something don't even be wrong with the man or the woman. They just prefer to go that route because to go that route, yes. Or uh, maybe the woman carry before, but always losing by five, six months, or you know, different things. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't want but the play on their body. You know, many people, celebrity, do it for them kind of reasons. And it is, it is very sad again. Mm -hmm. That is woman, woman, who are talking crap about this. This happened just yesterday. And if a woman can open her phone mm. and speak ill of something so precious and so, so delicate, because this is a delicate um, situation, because you can spend all this money and it doesn't come to term. It is very very delicate that's why she didn't speak about it sweet peach wow. and and you cannot show the other person who can take care of the baby okay. nine out of ten times they don't do that it yeah. is a private matter mm -hmm. very private so if she didn't talk about it i know she she's showing it and it's a lucky thing that she did from right. the hospital to you understand mm -hmm. because these nutheads I'm, they would say something different. I'm waiting for her to come out and talk more about the process, how they did it, and I'm waiting. You know? Yes, and it's going to be so exciting, yeah. Sweet Peach, for Nancy to tell her story. But mm -hmm. you see, some of these are going to run with it the, the opposite mm -hmm. way because they don't have any sense. Exactly. They don't have any sense. They don't listen with understanding either because if Nancy going to explain, they're going to twist it. True. And bring it their way. Exactly. But, I'm happy, sweet Peach. Me too. I'm happy for her. Yes. And I'm happy for the family. The whole family. And Did you see Papa? Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, yes. I saw I, I saw all of them. Yeah. And it's a good thing. It's a blessing. Try again, Mama. And yes. somebody is somebody's woman need to go sit down. I'm telling you. Right? Shut, talk because I didn't I hate it when when woman, woman, do this foolishness as a baby that you yourself can have a child anytime. Right. I'm gonna pray for other people. I don't know how people just get up nowadays because of money. Because uh -huh. of money in a sweet peach. They, they, they hate on kids, mm -hmm. they hate on another woman. Imagine. You understand? I'm not gonna send them my children. Yes. Come on, man. Mm -mm -mm. It's a blessing to bring somebody in this world. Yeah. And when you sit and you have your own kids running around and you talk bad about other people's kids. Right. And you don't know what tomorrow brings. Mm -hmm. That part, I understand how people do it in a sweet peach. Yeah, you don't true. know what tomorrow brings. Anything can happen <laughs> at this point of an eye. And, and you come out on a platform and talk in Hill about somebody <clears throat> else's kid. I don't mm. know if they're not afraid. They're not afraid in a sweet peach. They're not fear God. Then just get up and just talk. Anything mm. come at their mouth. Exactly. Anybody. The morning, and they're not here. You the have morning, kids. Morning, morning, Mama. You have Good kids. Morning, Be careful. Children. And you have family. Be careful when to talk out on a mouth about other people. True. I might come here and me talk about certain little things, but me now wish bad for nobody because I have a family. I lose my sister right now, sweet peach, only because sometimes I come on your platform. Yeah. I get a little he's 
for not thinking about it. Right. You understand? Right. Yeah. But it's something mm -hmm. that is killing me right down inside my stomach. Mm -hmm. Every day I get up and I have to yeah. try to think about different right. things. Right. You so understand? Not, yeah. So I don't dwell on it. Right. Because she was she was so dear to me. Yes. If I have to make a decision, is she may have. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You understand? Mm -hmm. I do nothing without her permission. Right, right. No, nothing at all. If mm -hmm. I have a little joke, as she may call and tell. I want to yeah. get up every day. I want to wish, wish death on people. I don't know how to sleep. You know? How to sleep. How to sleep. Some need to stop it, and a woman, big woman, mm -hmm. big woman, exactly. But should them not care about themselves or even them family, they don't care mm -hmm. about anybody else. Mm -hmm. That's what we do. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, stop it, man. Mm -hmm. Congratulations again to Nancy and and Chita, Cheta. Mm -hmm. Is it Cheta? <laughs> bro code. Mm -hmm. Let me just say bro code. <laughs> no, no, eh? Just say. Bro Bro code. Yeah, Congratulations. Yeah. I wanted to show you how stupid, how illiterate these people are. Even when I went to Nigeria and I was staying at Cheddar's um, um, Airbnb, look at how much crap they talk. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that was how illiterate these people are. Stupid. It's only because I'm afraid to fly. Yeah. I don't like to fly. You yeah. understand? Because yeah. my friends will always tell me, why you not go somewhere else? You always want to go to Jamaica. I'm like, Jamaica is like, maybe four hours three yeah. something tops if i was somebody who like to explore right, listen right. i would even go and 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 invest down there in one of those three million houses right listen, i would that... invest because it's not like it's gonna take me i would invest because i would save towards it but yes, listen yes. some of these them live leave the country sweet peach and they're never looking yeah. back then travel again and they, they like, don't have anything mm -hmm. because if, if that can give me three right. one three million can give me that house me now living in a european country and not go back home you're crazy right i will be building sure. but anyway sweet peach i'm not going to take up your time so but ladies be happy for people man yeah. it's, it doesn't take everything out of you say so congratulations i mean it from yeah. the bottom of your yeah. heart in not taking nothing. Be happy for people. Amen. Love, live, Amen. laugh. It doesn't take anything. Amen. Have a blessed day, Mama. Yes. Enjoy Amen. yourself. All right. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Hey, you too. How are you doing today, Mama? Oh, I'm doing wonderful. Good, good. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you to God. Amen. And hi, everybody. Yes. Good morning, good morning to everybody. Let's just... Oh, my goodness. Hmm. You know, what we're going to talk about, and what you guys are talking about this morning, and uh, I listen to everybody, their output, which I trust this platform, they, you know, mm -hmm. people who are not eligible, yeah. People who are knowledgeable, and because before they talk, they know what they are talking. They know if they don't understand, mm -hmm. they will go around and find, get information before they can come on this platform. Because we want knowledgeable people, people who knows what they are talking, not those people who go around and just say what they want to say. Right. Thank God for this line. Amen. You know, that we don't just talk because we want to talk. Yeah. You talk, let it make sense. Exactly. Let it make sense. Period. What is the big deal about surrogate? What's the big deal? Right. How can people get sick and they go to hospital? <laughs> Why do we get sick and go to hospital? Mm. Why do people have almost trying to fail them and they go and put pacemaker in their heart? True. They put a pacemaker in the heart and they live on. I've just given you some scenario before we come to the actual talk. Right. Why do people get pacemaker in their heart in order to keep them and they even live longer than the people who don't have pacemaker? True. 
because God gave the people, doctors, the wisdom and what they are using is to prolong or to give life to so many things on this earth. Mm -hmm. There are so many things happening right now. Yeah. How come we're supposed to give birth through the birth canal to go? But yet people do, doctors do cesarean. Right. So if your baby don't come to where it enter and where it come out, so it's not your baby. <laughs> so they do because God made it for the baby to go in the very direction and come out the same direction. Right. So if your baby don't went in the same direction, but they didn't come out the same direction, it came up as cesarean. So that's not your baby. Right. Okay. Now put on one there one side again. How come people have things like brain tumor, different kind of a diseases, mm -hmm. and then the doctor go in there and take it out? True. Because I just want people to know there is a solution and human being has authority on this earth. God gave them power and dominion mm -hmm. on this earth. Mm -hmm. And there are a lot of things that human being can do. The only thing God does not want human being to destroy human being's life. Yes. He said human being will work to in order to encourage one another. That's why this world was created for. Not for us to hurt one another, but to encourage one another, to work along with one another. And there are people who on this earth, born on this earth, with different gifts. Amen. Exactly. Different gifts. So let me come to me. Let's say congratulations to you and Shita. Con big congratulations to you for your newborn baby. Amen. Which is Talia. Yes. Talia. A very special name, and you can't find it just like that. I think Liberia will got one Talia that I know she's in politics. She's in politics. Mm -hmm. That's the only point because that's not a name that you just find all over the place. Talia. Yeah. You know? You don't find that name just like that. It's not common. Right. It's right. like the name Masa. It's not a common name that you just find it like that. So when she said Talia, I said, wow, we got a Talia in Liberia. She's very knowing. She's in politics. Her father is very rich. She got her own companies. Very vibrant girl. Mm -hmm. But let's say a surrogate. Then come, let me put that one side yet. Yeah. And come to the breastfeeding. My mother that bore me breastfed her sister because her mother got sick. Because my sister and her second her first sister, and she was the second, their mother was still having children. She was the first, I mean, the second child yeah. to the first child. So my mother was the second child. So when their mother had the two of them, when, the, when their mother had the, sec, the third child, mm -hmm. she got sick. At that time, my mother yeah. had just given birth to her first child. You understand? Mm -hmm. She had just given birth to her first child. So what did she do? She was breastfeeding her mother's daughter and her daughter. Wow. She was breastfeeding them, both of them. Wow. Yes, my mother did. Her brother next to her was mm -hmm. breastfed by her. Oh wow. And that 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 brother was in love with my mother through all until my mother left this world. Wow. And even when she got older, she said, nobody should forget about Guy, my brother. Mm -hmm. Nobody should forget about him. She saw that. Yeah. They told us that so we can know that these things can happen. Yeah. But some of these people that are talking, they don't have the kind of family that pass on. Mm. They, they are not knowledgeable to these things. Exactly. They were never close to their mothers. They were never close to their fathers. They were never close to family. Never. The family tree, they completely left from there. And nobody happy 
or loving or caring in the family. Because if you come up from a family that is loving and caring, and you guys are close, there's a lot you learn from a family tree. Right. There is a lot you learn from a family tree. Hmm. If a woman do a surrogate, they come just for the child to come. The mother spread and the father, the both egg will have to go together mm -hmm. to bring the baby. The only difference of that is the womb. Yeah. Yes. Because if the mother having a complication, not the father, because it is the womb that sometimes have a complication because of fiber or because of some, some complication. Yes. That the child don't stay every time. So instead of the child coming all the time and coming out, nobody knew whether the children were coming and they're going. And then she had to post stop to that to go to the doctor. And the doctor will say, the best way to do it is to do it this way. Mm -hmm. Because you are having complication. So we're going to rather bring the baby out this way because you still have the ability. Right. Because yeah. they they will test the father's brain that he stayed there to have babies. Babies are stayed there. The mother womb is maybe giving the complication or whatever there that she will not be able to conceive. Even if she conceived, she will not be able to carry that child for the full term. Yes. yes. She might have been conceiving and they're going. She conceived, they go. Yeah. She conceived the goal. So right there, you need to check a doctor. It goes to you all the women. Of course. We are children in the body. Yeah. Once, once you go the first time, the second time, the baby keep mm. going, mm. you have to seek a doctor. Yeah. For the doctor to tell you what's the cause of the miscarriages or whatever going in there. Right. And the best thing, if they, they, they check the husband's friend, that he's okay. And only where for the baby to lay down is not okay. Then they will ask to, to check another way in order to bring that baby up. Your spring, right. your spring, both completely secure. Mm -hmm. The person that going to carry those children or that child, because some people do. There's a girl here, she did, they did this. They're on the twin. Those children are so classic. You see them here, right in Rhode Island. The mother could mm. not carry them. Right. You yeah. know, somebody else carried them, but their own came out as a twin. Wow. Two boys. You see them exactly look like the mother and the father. Carried them right in this world, Allen. Very smart children. Okay, if you don't know about this kind of thing, then you move your mouth from there because you, people will just make fun of you. Exactly. People will just make fun out of you because you don't know. If you don't know, don't talk. Don't talk. Be uh, mm -hmm. If you don't know, no talk. Mm -hmm. You know? So if the doctor find out this is the best way to do it, because some people don't like to adopt children. Right. Because when you adopt a child, it's always to the back of your mind that that child is not your own. True. Some people can't take that. Some people can say, well, maybe if, if the adoption goes like most of the time, if the husband don't have the egg mm -hmm. and the wife have it, right. they still cannot carry it. They cannot have a child mm -hmm. because they both have to have it. They both have to come together to bring that. And if the husband cannot produce, mm -hmm. of course, they're going to leave it like that. They will have to adapt. That's why the doctor have to check to see whether the husband is capable mm -hmm. of producing a child. So when they pass that test, then they find they have the doctor will say, okay, this is what we need to do so that you can bring your children up. But right now, the womb that she has, is, it can produce, but it's not ready to give any, any egg or to raise up any egg into pee. But this will be the solution to that. Right. Go to India. India. Let them go and Google anybody on this land. Google India about surrogate. Google India. You will see India, they have different boots with their record because they, you have to check the person background. They have to check their records. They have to do every test on that mother that will carry that. Mm. Every test on that mother that is going to carry that baby in their womb. You go in there, they got their thing, their boots. You will see when you Google it, you will see their boots. Mm. 
It's a business in India. Mm. And don't the Indians produce a lot of doctors in even in America? Yes, yeah, true. Go go come all the hospitals here. You will find Indians. Yes. Exactly. So when you go to the booth, you will see the booth, the person got their doctor papers, they did mm. all, all their tests, they got everything, all their bi the, their background, they got it. That's how they make money in it. Majority of women make money in India. They carry your baby, nine months you pay them, they go. Yeah. Huh. You pay them, they will sit down, some of them will go, you feed them, you take care of them for the nine months they have your baby, they leave it right to the hospital and walk away. That's why they got to bring the woman that will carry that baby, they got to bring all their information from the doctor, yeah. and the mother and the father who are going to use that person have to make sure they are satisfied with that person before they can carry their child. Right. The womb will not preserve the child. Mm. The womb preserve the child, protect the child, and the child grow up in the womb. Yeah. But something has to go in the womb before the womb can protect and and and, and preserve the child and bring the child right. out. But what, whosoever put, whatever they put in the womb, that's what the womb going to bring out. It does not mean when you have the womb and you bring the child out, then that means the child is for you. No, it's not for you. Mm -hmm. But whosoever put, whatever they put in that womb is for the child. Let's say Jesus. Mm -hmm. Let's say Jesus. Mm -hmm. was, was Jesus. Jesus came here. They, 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 oh, God, help me today. Jesus was put in the womb of Mary. Jesus. Mm -hmm. You're who they're saying and they're talking part of nonsense. You don't know half sense. You're talking nonsense and you don't know half sense. Exactly. You don't know it. <laughs> Jesus was put in the womb of Mary. Because no man went to bear with her. Mm -hmm. But she conceived the baby. To the power of the Holy Spirit. And that baby came out. And who that baby father was? God. Yeah. And that's why some of you are struggling with it. How can God? Some people say the Islamic and other people. God does not have a wife. God, does not, God doesn't have to have a wife. God created a wife and God created a husband anyway. Sure. He doesn't have to. He created both of them. He said the bulls in the mountain. All over in the forest, the bulls, the goats, they are mine. If I were ever hungry, I would never come to man. I will go and take them and eat them. That means I can't come to man for anything. Mm -hmm. So everything, the earth is the law. And everything in the earth belongs to him. Yeah. So does he go begging for everybody to come? No. 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 Anything you see God do, mm -hmm. and He doesn't pull a stop to it, He revealed to redeem. He said, Secret things belong to mm -hmm. me, and if I reveal it to you, that means it's for you and your family, your children, your generation, and generation to come. Mm -hmm. When God created Adam and then took the woman from the ribs of Adam. And set up the place where he took the rape from and created the woman, he never revealed her secret. Yes. And because he didn't reveal that secret, there is no rape doctor. No doctor can cut your rip and operate on it. If your rib breaks, they can only put a prop, they can put a jacket to protect your, your ribs, to hold it together. Right. But there's no rib. The doctor will tell you, I will change their rib and I will put another rib or I will fix your rib. No. Mm -hmm. If you find a doctor, let me know. <laughs> if you find a doctor, because God did not reveal it. Yeah. But God made man to be able to do an anesthesia. Mm -hmm. God made man. Because why? He put Adam into sleep. He didn't have that. So man got to pick it up, oh yeah, before you operate on somebody, you can get an anesthesia, put them to sleep. Mm -hmm. 
So may I pick that up? He did it well. But then if man caught a man to take something from there and close it, man doing surgery, they're doing other things, they're doing this, they're doing this, but they can never repair or rip because he didn't give them that. But yet they can cut you, take something from there and close the bank. God gave them that. God gave us that. And those that he gave them the wisdom to do. Yes, they do. Yeah. If you don't have the wisdom, there are people who are born to do these things. Mm -hmm. There are people who are born to do these things. Right. We don't understand that a woman womb can carry a child that she doesn't have to have sex with a man and have the child. So God showed the difference from a, from a human thinking. Okay, we can use another womb but we can use from these people and put it in another womb to carry. Right. They put it in the womb. And then the womb come and deliver it. Because the only way a child, what about the one that bring it all the robbers? <laughs> Where you can put it in your baby. Yeah. That one you gotta put your baby in and robbers mm -hmm. carry. Mm -hmm. Robots carry your baby in the stomach. And then you tell you tell them hi, whether you want or the boy or gay. You're always saying that they are not even knowledgeable or not uh, knowledgeable about nothing. Mm -hmm. The guy don't teach they're standing there, pregnant already in the position. And then you want if you want a baby in nine months, you want a baby in ten months, you pay your money, you want a boy, you want a girl, you want a white, you want a black, they take and give it to you. That you don't know whose prayer it is. Mm -hmm. You don't know who's praying. You don't know who JJ came from. You don't know. You don't know who. What can I know? Some men that get JJ or what? I don't do. Huh? You don't know where it come from. Then they just take it and give it to you. Mm -hmm. But this will belong to them, and you will tell because the child will look like them. Yeah. Produced by mm -hmm. them, right. and they, before they produce it, before they took it from them. They test them. They went through a lot to come. Mm -hmm. In order for them to take that from them, yeah. to place it in the womb of a person. Do you know we have born with two kidneys? I heard some people can be born with one. Mm -hmm. But I know we're born with two kidneys. If one fail you, do you know they can take a kidney from somebody else and give it to you and you live yeah. on it? Yes. Yes, yes they do. They care about both of you. I remember a Liberian guy was here, as he stayed here anyway. He was almost at the point of death. Mm. Hanging up, hanging from there, suffering like nobody business. He got dry small. They had all kinds of tubes hanging on him. Finding a way to get, to get him one kidney to help him out. Because the other mm. eight kidney was not too good to bike him up. So the one kidney that damaged, they took that one out and the other one, he was struggling yeah. with it. So what did they did? They paid his sister away from Liberia. That's a man. They paid his sister away mm -hmm. from Liberia. Yeah, we went to the hospital because we were praying. Yes. We went to the hospital and the sister agreed they gave her visa. She came here to the hospital. The both of them had to get an appointment. They have to test her blood, whether she are A positive or B positive or whatever they had to check. Mm -hmm. And the brother was here, one man, one part. The brothers that were here never had the same blood. But the sister that were in Liberia, they had the same A plus. Oh. Yes. Mm -hmm. He had brothers and sisters here, one man, one part, but they never had the same blood. Wow. They could have given it to him, but they never had the same blood. So they had to get the one from Liberia. The American government gave him, gave her visa to come to give her brother one of kidney. And she was the oldest among mm. them. Wow. She was the oldest. Mm. So she came. When she came, they took her to the hospital. The day she arrived here, it was like he was so happy. He was so happy. It's like somebody here to give my life back to me. Because that was the only hope he had. Mm. That was the only hope. Mm. So when he when she came, 
We went to the hospital. The both of them had to be on the machine. Everything had to be set for the hour. She had to go to sleep. He had to go to sleep. They had to put both of them to sleep to take the kidney from here, transfer it on this side. Can you imagine that? Wow. All day we were at the Royal Island Hospital. Mm -hmm. All day. Sitting there to make sure that guy's life is safe. Yeah. And when they got through, mm -hmm. we were in the hospital with him. Mm -hmm. When he got out of there, it was like his sister. His sister. And simple thing happened to that guy to dam that damaged his kidney. You know, when the phone came new day, yeah. they used to, those men used to like putting the phone on their side, you know, to bluff with it, to have, you know, dress and put it on their side, mm -hmm. you know, like what the police people can dress. Exactly. He's not in the ice. And the thing that was on the thing, juke on his side and mess with his kidney. Oh, wow. Yes. That's why it's not good to put things, especially when it's snowing, it's icy on the yeah. ground, and you're putting things on your side to walk with it. You know, it's not good. That's what happened to him. Oh, my God. He fell in the snow and it juke on his side and mess with his kidney. He was bleeding internally, but he didn't oh, know. When it got serious, they took in the kidney are already damaged. Wow. Yes, so that's how come his sister came and gave him the kidney. Yeah, and he stayed alive. What I'm telling you about is about let's say doing 2000, 2000 something, maybe 2001 or 2002, because we both started working in 2001, 2002, yeah. let's say 2005. This took place. Oh, wow. He stayed alive. Suppose a sister had not come to give him the kidney, mm -hmm. and the sister that gave him the kidney was way older than him. Mm -hmm. But her kidney was all right. Yeah. His own gave up. Mm. So doctors will always find solution yeah. for things that we know that is harmful to people or will shut people life down in, uh, quickly so they can you know come in and do something. Yeah. So if a woman and her husband come together in unity and love, nobody know what they said in their closed door. They have the right. The spirit belongs to them. The child is their blood. It came from them. Came from the father and the mother. That's why they are proud of it. Exactly. Very proud. It's not the womb that carries the child. It's the body that produces the sperm that enter the womb. Exactly. That's close the case. Close the case. So you, why uh, went when she went and and and, and make mockery of, of Hannah, because Hannah couldn't have children, mm -hmm. Hannah couldn't have a child. God got upset. God did not like that. Mm -hmm. Go to the Bible today. You will never, beside that scripture, you will never find Penada name anywhere near her children. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Because she made mockery of Hannah. Mm -hmm. And God, Hannah made a deal with God. Hannah got the child. Her mockery time was over. She even had other children. She kept her vow, took the child, carried the child back to God. And God used Samuel as a prophet in the Bible. One of the greatest prophets. You don't play with things like that when it comes to children. And you're making fun of them, making fun of people. Mm -hmm. Nobody know what happened to Pinara and her children. Mm. Nobody knows. Her name not anywhere. Her name completely erased. God didn't even use none of her children, neither herself, just for making mockery as a mother. Yeah. Making a mockery. Mm. You got to be very careful. True. We all got to be very careful what you say about somebody what you do to a baby if that baby that baby today was lying over there yeah. crying born you can tell that that, that shit that baby mm -hmm. exactly that baby now they're bringing you things why don't you go I mean, they, they, he slept with another woman and the woman then they care baby why would you even think of something devilish like that the only person that would think of somebody, some of your guy, your children, literally. and they're not even for the father. Yeah, true. Some of your guy, children, not even for the father. <laughs> uh, because Africa, they don't do DNA. Some of you are not even for your own father. True. Some of them are not even for their own father. But because Africa, no DNA, 
Anybody can do anything, anybody can try anything, anybody can say anything, anybody, anybody in Africa. Yeah. You can poop anywhere you want to poop. You can wipe your butt with a leaf if you got if you got a uh, paper or how do you call it toilet tissue. You can go get a leaf. Mm -hmm. Or you can wipe your butt on the on the tree if you got no paper towel or or, or, or toilet paper. Yeah. Anybody can do whatever they want. Mm -hmm. You don't do DNA. What are your born children from in the street? You don't print DNA. You're pregnant for people from outside. Your husband they can't even pregnant you. Exactly. Your husband, your husband, they can't even pregnant you. They don't even have no egg to pregnant you. Some of y'all went to other other men, and you're carrying that baby today and pretending to the husband that a child for him. You think mm -hmm. we don't know these secrets? We know them. If they go today and carry DNA in Africa, many of y'all will cry with your blood flowing from your eyes. Exactly. <laughs> because maybe your father, that's some kind of crazy man in the street. Yeah. Some of your father, that's some kind of crazy man sitting in the street, but you're ashamed to tell people because your mothers were sleeping with them. True. <laughs> I'm telling and you. And how you? Some of your father, then that crazy man <laughs> sitting down there, but you're taking another man to be your, your father. But the actual man you're taking to be your father is not actually your father. Right. Your father is a crazy man passing around who are going around and a lot of things and end up crazy in the street. But you are ashamed. Exactly. Maybe your mother never told you. To somebody who loves each other. Somebody who, people who love each other. Mm -hmm. And you see that child you know. And the woman is sure that her husband, and her husband is sure that his wife, that the, both of them got together. And through the power of the brain, knowledgeable doctors bring it together, brainstorming what we can do in order to produce, to help women who wombs are not able to conceive full time to bring the baby up. What can we do? And they came to that conclusion. And today they are helping a lot of mothers. They are helping families. Mm -hmm. They are doing a lot of things right now in this world. Mm -hmm. Many children all around here, senators, representatives, most of them came to surrogate. Yes. Most of them. Very smart and intelligent people. Good people. It doesn't mean they go like that, they China for you. The only thing, no child belongs to any womb. The one that put a child in the womb, that's the one that owns the child. It's not a womb. Exactly. Let me let you know this. That child, she taught a nurse, put it in that womb. And the one self that brought the baby, they brought the baby out of that womb, that person knows that the child does not belong to her right she knows yeah because first thing most of the most of the people that sit down to take those things they don't they don't they don't they don't even conceive their own children some of them are virgin true Is that some of them are virgin when you go go google and listen to them some of them just want to make money until later on later on they can marry after they got what they want go check india you will see how many do in India? Go check it. And come back and tell me, say, Mama La, go and do your research. The God of Boot is a business in India. Mm. But some of y'all sitting in Africa, y'all don't know these things. Y'all get up and say, what's the big deal? Sure. Exactly. If I want the children, if I want the children, I would rather do that than going to adopt a child. Mm -hmm. I'd rather do that than to adopt a child. Because when my child comes, I know it is my exactly. child. Exactly. It is my, my Me child. Too, mm -hmm. Some people, yeah, not because it didn't enter the mm -hmm. womb, mm -hmm. but it came from there, from around there. It came back home. Yeah. They, they protect the mother and gave the mother because her hormones are acting in another person's womb. She will feed her. She will have those experience. Every experience. Right. That a woman can have. Nessa went to it. Exactly. Because her, her blood was in readiness to come. The blood of Shita was in readiness to come. Mm -hmm. So that child, you will see when that child come up exactly like them. It's no different of anything. So any woman who will get up ain't got nothing to do for themselves. They ain't got nothing to say. 
But they just want five dollars and ten dollars. I wish I could call them on the side and be giving them five dollars and ten dollars every day so they can shut up. They ain't gotta do that. They ain't gotta get you that just for five dollars, right, Mama? No. Mm -hmm. Then I will give them five dollars every day to help them out. <laughs> Hey, go on, five dollars. You don't have to stay there to bring people down. Somebody who is able, go to surrogate right now in America. It's very expensive. Yes, exactly. Africa right now, I think it's cheaper in Nigeria. It might be cheaper in Nigeria or whatever in any part. And that's even a, a, a good thing True. for Africa to have such. Exactly. She brought it out for everybody. It's not a secret thing. It's something good because a lot of women in Africa a lot of women around the world, mm -hmm. they're warm, they got complications, they cannot mm -hmm. produce. There's a girl from Guatemala working with me. Her four miscarriages just had. Oh my. Four. Wow. Since she started working, four miscarriages. So if that girl got the knowledge, yes. Yes. and I would take Nessie video exactly. and show it to her. Yes, exactly. Take Nessie because she said she worked with me. I would take Nessie Nessie video and mm -hmm. show it to her and say, "Look at this! Oh, the baby, the baby!" I say, "If you know what happened," and I will explain to her exactly. Because if she get money, she work for money. She and her husband can go and do the same thing instead of losing the baby every time the baby come in. The baby go three months. The baby go three months. The baby go two months. The baby go. Something is wrong. There is a complication in there. Right. And the best way you can do is to do it that way. Get your sperm, get your husband's sperm, and they do the surrogate. Anything can happen. That's it. If the Holy Spirit allow it to happen, we're not making comparison of Jesus Christ, but the Holy Spirit did it. They say the child, they say it happened through the Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. Mary conceived. Right. Did the Holy Spirit sleep with Mary? No. Did God sleep with Mary? No. Because he is God. But he produced his only son to Mary. I the you. child entered the womb mm. without no man sleeping with her. Right. The child, the child entered the womb. Don't you think men who God have given wisdom to can say, okay, if this happened, about this Jesus, let's see what we can do. And I bet the person who had the idea, who brought the idea in the medical field, probably might have thought of that. If God can do this, maybe we can do it this way for a woman to carry a child without sex. Exactly. Even though that child is not going like Jesus, because nobody gave strength, nobody gave nothing. Mm -hmm. But it was through the power of the Holy Spirit. But more men can use it in our human world to bring it another way. Right. If that happened, then you will sit and make fun of a baby. That's somebody who heartless. The people who are very heartless that we ever want to do that to a baby. Yeah. A newborn baby. Instead of cherishing a baby that just coming in the world. Mm -hmm. To a father and to a mother, they cherishing that baby. They love that baby. We that know them cherishing the baby. Mm -hmm. And you come and sit down to put moth on a baby that you don't know mm -hmm. who that baby will become. Sure. You don't know. Some of you are putting bad luck on yourself for mm -hmm. life. Yes. And putting bad luck on your children for mm -hmm. life. Yep. Because of the little grumpy, the little penis mm -hmm. that you guys get in. Little penis that you guys get in. Right, right. Little penis. Because there's the only way of survival. You wait till the day come. The only way of survival that you have to talk about somebody, that you have to denigrate somebody in order to get your little grumpy. Right. You can't do nothing good for yourself by you seeing that. That they, maybe the child is, uh, maybe the other children are like that. Maybe the other children go bring your own children, father, because some of y'all got three, two, three children, and the men that y'all got that's not their father. Exactly. <laughs> there are a lot of things in Africa mm -hmm. under secret, mm -hmm. it can't come up. The day they carry DNA, some of y'all will not have about 75% will not have father. I'm telling you, they won't know 75% will not have father. <laughs> But I thank God, TNA, and they're doing surrogate now in Nigeria. Sooner or later, TNA will hit that ground. 
I think it's, DNA, I think... go right DNA will hit that ground and start putting your butt outside one by one. I'm telling you. Stop putting your butt on top. Yeah. Anybody can do so again. Anybody can do it if they have the money Anybody. to do so. Because, because as somebody going to go through, you can be 50 year old, you can be 75 year old, you can be 80 year old. You want you want you want a baby with your husband? You can go do it. You got your money. Somebody will kill the baby. Once the man is able to produce, because the sea is in the man. It is the man that God gave the seed to. It is the man that's supposed to be able to produce it. And once they produce it, back up with the woman to put it in the womb. That's how powerful the womb is. The womb can conceive and bring it up. I'd rather somebody to conceive my baby than to give my baby to a robot. Then to take my sperm or somebody else's sperm and robot came in and I paid 30000 dollars for it. No, that baby market is not the right market. But I think it rather you do this than to go into the, the baby baby market to go put in for babies. Put in for babies. Thirty dollars, thirty-five thousand dollars, thirty thousand dollars. Whether you want boy, you want girl, you want white, you want black, and then they bring it the next morning, they ship it to your house. Shit. Yeah, they ship it to your house. They will tell you, you see the, the robot that pregnant? Oh my. No, I mean, but to be shipping it to you and doing all. Mm-mm-mm. Yeah, they put all that they ship your baby. When your baby start acting like a robot, then that one you will know. But this is the best way to do it. Yeah. The womb can carry a child. The womb does not have to sleep with nobody. Mm-hmm. And most of the womb that carry the baby, some mothers. Before they do this, they, they surrogate, they want the person to be clear out. Some of them want a virgin yeah. who have never conceived before. Mm-hmm. Most of them. So the person got to pick, they got to bring. They got to bring them. They check their records. They bring them. You want a mother who have not conceived before, mm-hmm. then they can bring it exactly like that. Yes. And most, most of them, they don't carry to the birth canal some of them, when the baby grow in the stomach, the doctor do cesarean and get the baby yes, out. True, exactly. And get the baby out. And the mother will be prepared to feed that baby because they will give their pre- they give them everything that was supporting the baby when they born. Prenatal care, everything to get the milk into her breast, everything. They got treatment for all. And they will take them and their baby will, will eat, drink and eat. The woman don't have to breastfeed your child. Because if the woman breastfeed your child, the fluid that's coming out, they already prepare you for it so you can breastfeed your right. child. Right. Mm-hmm. Ah, man, I can tell you. They don't know, mama. And most of the women that can, that can, that can carry it, that, that they can, carry, can carry the babies in their home, sometimes their mother and the father don't know them. True. You're right about that. And they don't even know the parents. Exactly. They don't even know the parents. They don't know the parents. They carry it like that. So if you are not able to do that because you don't have the money, don't go pay your money for anybody. That's their baby. You are one of those that stand about to say, Jesus is not the son of God. Because God didn't sleep with with, with Mary. And some of you are still saying that. You're going to church, hallelujah, praise the Lord. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. But yet in your heart, you still believe that Jesus Christ is not the son of God. Mm -hmm. Jesus Christ is the Son of God. Your thing completely negative because your grandfather, which is the JD bomb, mm-hmm. telling you that negativity will give you money, that he roll your own. The same role he put your own, the same church he gave you, the same bench you're still sitting on, you're still carried to the back of your mind. That negativity is the way to go. But we are still telling you positivity is, it, is the way to go. Positivity is the way to go. If you are positive in this world, you will learn. You will learn better things instead of living on the wayside for a few dollars. Amen. Indeed. Few dollars. There are some people coming on this line. They don't have to come here, but they come here because they fight for somebody else's child. Because they look at these children as children Mm -hmm. that somebody born them and did not live. Lord, on this earth to be with her children. Exactly. And then we need to gather together to be with those children, to encourage them. Because that's what the Bible says, we should encourage one another. Why about loving your neighbor as thyself? 
But some of you don't even love yourself. You're a bunch of F O O O S fools. That's what some of you. Yeah. Some of y'all ain't got no brain. Y'all brain for the nuts. nuts. Brain for the crackers. But nuts. That's what some of you are. Brain for the crackers. And when y'all stand there, you think I can, they pass you. Some of y'all, y'all slap with teachers and they pass you. <laughs> then y'all say, you are educated. What for your education? <laughs> you slap with the teacher. You, you may say goodbye and you slap with the teacher for <laughs> five for number five, so they can give you 70. I tell you, yeah. you slap with the teacher. Yeah, you made you made you made sister. You slap with the teacher, he enjoy himself for 15 points. Then you gave her 75. <laughs> you pass, mm -hmm. then you pass, you pass. There you go, you pass that one. You go over there, but you are not knowledgeable about nothing. True. They were that people trying to study to Google, go around to do research to find out things. Yeah. You stay passing and you stay passing. Everything passing by you. The same way you pass, the same way you pass, that hard things passing by you too. And you don't know nothing. You don't know nothing. But to say that on Facebook, blue app, to bring other people down. You don't know it. Yes. Because you don't know. Plenty, plenty. You, down. you made 20. <laughs> Go ahead. You make twenty. You 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 take the test. You win. You fail all oh, twenty. Then you ask the what, what can I do? The teacher, the teacher said, meet me to the hotel. You will pass. Exactly. Meet me to the hotel. You will pass. Bend down on force. You will yes. <laughs> I go. Yeah. I can't go to beyond me there. Go over there. Then you pass. Then you say, well, come here, sit down. You are educated. How far your education okay. carry you? Please. When we supposed to continue learning. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Knowledge is power. Yeah. You heard JJ talking there right here. No. And you hearing me saying it. That knowledge is power. If you don't have knowledge or you are not knowledgeable, you will not go anywhere. Because generation changing from one level to another. Yeah. Every yes. day we work up, our children got different mind. We got different mind. We that came before y'all got different mind. Y'all who here right now, y'all got different mind. True. Some of y'all even 50, 60 year old. You're still thinking that like you're 16, and you can't be 16. Why? Because of the realistic, <laughs> the realistic, and the oh, thing that what you can tell your curly hair to him or her, <laughs> and the nails alone. Then you think you're all right. You're not all right. Mm -hmm. you're not all right. The Chinese people making your cuckoo craziness. <laughs> craziness <laughs> got you <laughs> sitting there. You ain't going nowhere. Yeah. Nessa and her sister Cora, they're carrying their life. We only come here to talk because we started it and God wants us to do it. We come here to talk. But who say we come here to bring them down? No. Yeah. We come here to encourage them in their life so they can move on to do something better. Not to be like you. Every day you got nothing to do. Mm -hmm. Your husband tea shut shut and your children tea long long. What happened? Jesus. Your husband can see. Your children got cross eye. Why Why they get a cross eye for? <laughs> Why are children got a, why are children got a cross iPhone? You got a cross iPhone. You got a bonnet, baby? They say one guy was here in, in Minnesota, no Ohio. His wife right in the, in the place there in Ohio. He will leave his wife and go all around. So he slept with one black American girl. <clears throat> he slept with one black American girl. Then the girl said that the child for him. And he was hiding it from his wife. He wanted his wife to know that he pregnant again. And all the club, he and the guy used to go there and have good time. Yeah. When the baby king, the baby king would cross eye. So the guy said, you don't want to support the baby, I'm going to take, the, take, take it to your wife. That the excuse again, do I have any cross eye? Uh -uh. Do I have cross eye? You see me look like somebody with cross eye. None of my family got cross eye. Well, the baby come with cross eye. The guy said, maybe you slept on your cross side. <laughs> maybe when you're coming, your eye will cross. <laughs> the guy said, maybe you're coming, but I will take you and you will pitch our support. <laughs> so I went to Ohio, I said, well, if the guy say you slept on a cross eye, or maybe you are coming, you came with cross eye. Because maybe a good time. Well, go take care of the baby. 
bless your baby. The girl got things to prove on the baby that your baby. How come the eye cross? She don't know. <laughs> Maybe there's something that caused the eye to cross because you were thinking about your wife home and the same time thinking about oh yeah when you will go home and the baby self saw it and the baby king will yeah. cross eye. <laughs> So don't blame the don't blame the woman. You put the thing in the womb. So you're gonna blame the woman while the baby got cross mm -hmm. eye. You gonna take your cross eye, baby. Go to the judge. The judge will call you. Go tell the judge say the baby got cross eye. So you will not pay child support. You will pay child support. You what are the child that one foot and the guy one hand? They got cross eye. You will pay child support. <laughs> You will pay. What are the guy one toenail? Yeah. What are the guy one finger? What are the guy five fingers? You will pay because you the one with the your car. You won't pay child support. Eh? Go get me anywhere. And George will see the eye and know that's my child. Who judge? Yeah. Who judge yeah. gonna see the baby eye and say that's not your baby? Right. Yeah. Who, gonna, who, who judge gonna see the baby eye and say that's not your baby? You the one that said that's not your baby. <laughs> Because he got cross eye. Go do DNA now. They did a DNA came by the baby. Now you go tell again now. How come you put cross eye baby in her stomach? They did a DNA. They did a DNA. Like you remember, they did a DNA, the baby for him. 100%, 99.9. The child belonged to him. My God. Mm. Yes. Mm. So today now he got to take you. He will cross eye, baby. And and the, the child that you were calling cross yeah. eye, the child is doing so well. The that? child so well in school. Oh. He in college wow. right now. Wow. Look then you were condemning the baby mm. because the baby had cross eye. You got cross eye. None of my children get cross eye. Where did I get cross eye before? They fixed the boy eye. Wow. Yeah, they went and fixed the eye oh. you know when the eye cross like that yeah. they fix it and then it put it straight oh wow okay. yes they can do that they can do that they mm. fix it you would you you look at the, the boy you will not even know that he was born with a cross oh, eye wow. oh. they fix it they straighten it up mm. you know they straighten yeah. it up now today he's part of that child yeah. but look at all the things you say about that baby if they had not done the dna he was going to say stay that you know nothing about the girl <laughs> Oh, God, and you were making your wife to feel like that too. Eh, eh, why are you talking? I said, You with me? You are so mm -hmm. silly. Mm -hmm. That's why the men will always make you to look like a fool. I'll tell you. You're so silly. Your husband goes there around. He said, Go look at the eye, boy. Look at my eye. Is that my eye? Hello? Go look at the eye. Go look at the eye. I will never do that. Look at that baby eye. Look at my eye. Look at the baby eye. Look at your eye. The dead DNA that you. That's you. That's you there. <laughs> so we gotta be we gotta be careful how we treat people yes, yes. we gotta be careful the child is yours is yours Period. the people wanted to bring their child away because of something i know it got to be complication yes. nessa is young shita is young they are not all people right but they must have some complication from the womb and they had to bring their children they want more children they want more responsibility not like your irresponsible people sitting down on social media and got a thing to do with your right. own self bunch of irresponsible people they're going to take care of their child they will embrace their child they were happy their father embraced the child and they're out there you don't have you have children they ain't got no father and you lie on your husband they're not your husband's children if you say that lie go to the dna and put it on facebook let me see it. 99.9 .9. that's what it called 99.9 .9. go do the children dna the huh? <laughs> no they won't do it they even got healthy babies they even got healthy babies True. No, they even got some of them even got healthy babies mm -hmm. but they still want to pull more from other people so they can get a mm -hmm. few dollars mm -hmm. i'm sorry for you you're who doing those things you're stopping because you ain't got no life because if you got life you will never do such exactly. to anybody you will never do such to a newborn baby. You don't know who that child is going to be.
True. Some of you have completed witchcraft, which is born, which is evil in your heart, bear up to do evil to people. Exactly. And you wake up in the morning, come on to talk evil. Your camo, your camo, your camo, your camo. Every day people will come, -o, they will come. -o. But one day somebody will call on your two, say your camo, your can here. The husband said the children are for him. Yes. One day. It will happen on this line. God bless you. Hey, I see your boss, man. Hey, boss, you in. I saw you lying down in the bed. Exactly. When you see your boss, man, I'm talking again. Some of your butt will get empty right here on the social media. And we will know who, who your children for. Thank God you. bless you. Thank I you. love you. Let's say congratulations. Amen. Amen. To you and Shita for your for Talia. Yeah. Yes. Talia yeah. in the world. Yeah. Talia is in the picture. Talia is in the picture. Nobody else in the picture. Talia yeah. is in the picture. This is her turn. Let her have a good time. Let her be best fair. Let her be taken care of. Be proud of her. Your, your cherish her. Your love for her. God will be with her. God will direct her on this side. God will do everything yeah. possible. That's a life that is birth to you yeah. both. And you're cherishing. God bless you. I love you. Thank you. With the love of love God. You too. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Ways them on ways them on ways them. I wish, I wish, I wish, I pray that one day some of these people, these illiterate people, will just come along and listen to words of wisdom. And maybe then y'all will wake up, y'all will start living a different type of life. You know, I pray to God that y'all do it someday. But I'm sure you will come and listen and probably say some nonsense because you didn't get it. But that's not for us to decide or determine. Pauline Johnson, thank you so much for three coffees. Appreciate you. Appreciate you all that send stars as well. That share this video, just being here each and every day, standing for the truth, standing against injustice, and keeping it real. Do a shigu quote it. You speak it, you speak the truth. Facts. That's all that matters. So for anybody else, to each his own, right? We say it, that we are happy for Nancy and the family. It's a beautiful baby girl. If you go back, some of one of that talk and go and pull up baby pictures of one of the kids, if one of got any, if one of got any, and see how they look when you have them. If one of got any again, because some of you people don't care about nothing like that. But at the end of the day, Talia is going to live a much better life than you or any of your generation ever could. Period, period, period. My people, I love you all. God bless you all, and I'll see you in the next one. Enjoy the rest of your day.